Hello. Welcome. Welcome to a, a surprise stream. Today we're doing Shipwreck 64. Uh, this was something I remember seeing a while back. There was like a, a I think it was like a year ago or something on like itch.io there was a a game called Shipwreck that show up showed up and it was like this game that never released or, or something. It's like a, a lost media type game, right? I don't really know a lot about it. I wanted to check it out, I just never got around to it. But, uh, it turns out today, uh, just casually, the developer, I, I forgot their name, I think it was Squeaks, uh, they released a full version on Steam. I don't know if there's like extra stuff in it, but this looked like really up my alley. It looked very like ARGE, which I hate that term, but also, it looked cool. <laughs> Hello, UT fam. I'm gonna move over there. Hopefully, that's a good spot. But, um, but yeah, this is Shipwrecked. I don't really know much about it, but I, I want to stay here for a second because I, I was just sitting here on the menu before the stream started and, like, a pizza tower-ass thing happened where something scary happened before the game started. But, um, I don't know. How's everybody doing? I'll, um... I'll just let this, like, do its thing real quick. Hopefully it's not a random event, uh, but I'll give it some time. Hope everyone's doing well. Hope everyone is enjoying 2024. I slept terribly last night. I could not sleep, and it sucked. But, oh well. Did you mean to put the IGN link in the Discord? <laughs> Thank you. I, I literally just copy whatever YouTube I had in my, uh... I copy whatever like YouTube link I had in my my clipboard. Let me fix that. <laughs> Let me fix that one real quick. Dude, this music goes hard. There we go. I fixed it. Thank you for pointing that out. I, I sent people to like the the weird Steamboat Willie thing. <laughs> In case it's a one-time only event, you just erase the save data. Oh, did I mess up with the save data? I don't think it did. Do I need to be tabbed into the game? I, the game started to, like, fade to, to gray, and it started zooming in slowly, but... I'm assuming this is probably it, because it did go quiet when I, was, when I was playing. We'll see what happens. Is it zooming in? Oh! Scary! Oh! Look in the corner! Scary! <laughs> uh oh, it's it's becoming scary game. Ooh. <laughs> what is that? Is is it a person? Who is I don't know. I guess we'll learn as we go cuz I don't really I don't know the lore on this. I'll read you the description cuz I'm pretty sure it's just going to like throw me into whatever the hell this game is, but I think the description will help like set the tone cuz I don't think it'll explain itself. Hello. I don't know your name. You are you shipwreck, shipwrecked? Oh, stop! I don't like you. <laughs> oh, did it crash? I don't know what happened. <gasps> Hello, what are you? You're like that was like an AI generated human. Who was that? <laughs> Wait, did it just throw me into the game? Oh, I'm gaming. Shipwreck sixty four. So yeah. This is apparently, uh, like, an N64 game that... Let me, let me get the Steam description that I, that I blatantly copied and pasted. I need to change that afterward. Um, but, so this is Shipwreck 64, right? It's, Bucky and his friends need your help. After a sudden crash during a routine fishing trip, Bucky ends up on a mysterious island, where his friends appear to be apprehended by a pack of wolves for disturbing the peace. Embark on a puzzle-based adventure as Bucky wanders the vast island of Nulla Terra, helping his friends work off the damages. Fix your boat and get back home. Um, and it says, like, what is this? Shipwrecked was an old game originating from the late 90s, commissioned by the beloved Broadside Animation Studio, developed by a relatively unknown game studio, Cogware Games. The game had a very mysterious nature surrounding its launch. It was only available from August 13th, 1997 to August 17th, 1997. So like four days. It got little promotion from Cogware and none from Broadside. 
So like no one knows about this game. It's, it's some sort of lost media. Uh, this downloadable version of the game is the closest one you can get to playing the original copy of the game. We at the Shipwreck Recovery Crew were lucky enough to get our hands on an original cartridge, dumped it, and converted a lot of the code to new software. With help from two of the original developers, we were, we were able to make this game accessible to everyone. So yeah, they, they recovered the lost media. Um, though I believe those are all just like fake companies and stuff, and I don't know, I don't really don't know what else is in this but i'm hoping there's new stuff in it and i don't know because this is the steam release of it i don't know if there was like an update uh i, I looked at the itch.io page and it didn't look like there was an update so maybe this has exclusive stuff i don't know i didn't check out the original so i'm just kind of excited to to play it what do i do settings we got to go to settings we got to deal with this this is important how do i go in the door um, A, B, Y, X. X is our door opener. What the hell is this? Dude, I got triple jumping? Boing. What are you? Are you my computer? No, that's a modem, right? Make your choice. <laughs> what the hell is this? Make your choice. Online play? Keeps all of the online code, purpose unknown, recommended some interesting corruptions relate to this. Or go offline. I want to be, I don't want to not get the full experience. Hopefully it doesn't dox me, but I got to go in. Online play activated. I, this is like some inscription shit where it was like, are you sure you want to do online play? It's like, is it not just a single player card game game? <laughs> My TV. Dude, I should have set up the ah. Oh, I should have set up the Silent Hill thing, like uh, scene for this. I think it would have worked really well. That's straight up the TV I have in that scene. Simulated CRT effect will be rendered recommended for full immersion. Or uh, no, I will simulate. I like the CRT filter. Malware downloaded. You know it. I'm ready to get a virus. I also I got some new filters set up. So we can have an authentic N64 type experience. Um, how does this sound? Does, does this sound, is this good mic quality? Is this going to work for the playthrough? My Let's Play Part 2. Hey guys, welcome to the channel. Today we're playing a, a, a little gym called, um, I forgot the name. <laughs> Something 64, <laughs> Shipwreck 64. I got it guys. Got my new webcam set up. You can tell the quality is very high. Uh, <laughs> that sounds clearer than your regular microphone. I don't believe you. I don't think I'll, I'll use that, that filter. <laughs> I don't know. I hate it, but I got a new like VST where I can make it. I can make it sound like I'm coming through a TV or anything. It's really good. Make your choice. Thumbstick turning. Modern controllers benefit from this option. Turn, turning is smooth. Um, this is more accurate, right? Vintage controllers benefit from this option. I'm just a modern gamer. Please use it. You don't want this bandy cam ass filter. I sound like I'm coming from a TV. Oh. <laughs> I mean, this is this is this harkens back to the day, like you would find a video like this in 2007 of someone like. Welcome back to my channel, um, playing this game I found, 1997, August 13th, I gotta turn this off, I hate it, <laughs> take me back. <laughs> Alright, bonuses, you know I want the bonuses. Oh, I love this, I love this aesthetic so much, I love the, the crusty N64 era stuff. Collected secrets, yes. What do we got? I don't, why am I even going? Oh, hello. Fry Fazbear. I don't like that sound. When did you start streaming underwater? Just today. Wait, there was, there was more bonuses. Hold up. The original experience will be streaming at 240p. I mean, I could make it worse. I can like, I hope this doesn't crash my OBS. That would be embarrassing. <laughs> this is going to be embarrassing. I can make it real bad. Like, we can get... 
we can get crusty. <laughs> What's up, guys? Um, I found this game. <laughs> Holy shit, it's so bad. <laughs> uh, just set up my OBS. Found this game in the the store today. Trying to get to the gallery here. I got it. This mess. Um, <laughs> I can't. I can't keep that on. <laughs> I want to, but uh, it's too ugly. I should focus on the game. I hate this camera angle, okay. This showed up, I don't know what the heck this thing is. It showed up when I boot the game up. It showed up for like two seconds. And I don't know what it is, but it, I hit X and it did something, it went <laughs> Let's just play a new game, let's just, some play some shipwreck 64 right my favorite video game from 1997 Ooh, the game that was removed from shelves oh so i have to play the 2023 remake first as it was intended to be played and then oh okay then i get the scary version okay i'm down hello I need your help. Step into the 3D realm with Bucky and his friends. Explore a vast open island and hopefully bring your friends back to safety. I will. So what do you say? Buddy? I hate... Let's go rescue the gang. I hate this guy. What's his name? I'm pretty sure I read the name somewhere. I can't remember the name. Yo, they got the dang cartridge, and the art doesn't match, like, any of the art in the game. That's, like, very... <laughs> it's very accurate for N64. Hello! Welcome to Shipwreck 64 2023. Bucky the Beaver. Okay, okay. Bucky the Beaver. That's me. Shipwreck 64 was meant to release in 1997, but was pulled after three days for reasons we now know. We know them? We've been working on trying to restore the game. This is the closest possible thing to a finished copy. Oh, look at the model. You got the wireframe. We were able to transfer most of the game to new software, but had to fill some gaps ourselves. Okay. This version of the game is mostly clean. Uh-oh. I'm worried. I want to play the dirty version. Hmm. Reminds me of the Duck Hunt horror game. Um, what is the with a VR one? I think I know what you're talking about. Day one. Oh my god. I have to. I need to play more N64 and like GameCube era games. This is just making me feel good, like something good. Hello. Oh hi. It's me, Bucky Beaver. Looks like my prayers have been answered. Listen, you gotta help me. I was out on the sea with my friends, and I crashed my boat. It was awful. And my friends were all kidnapped. It was pretty bad, yeah. But you can help, right? Here, let me show you how it works. How what works? Try using the analog stick to move. Of course, I played a video game. You can also press A to jump. When no one's talking. Oh, I tried to jump and he got, he got mad at me. Press the green B button to interact. Oh, this is N64. Oops. Don't, don't tell Bucky Beaver I'm on a, a dang Xbox controller. I'm not emulating it, I swear. Press the green button. You can also press right bumper to hit. I have a... That's straight up the Spider-Man getting his ass slapped sound. Remember to look for canvases, too. You can save on those. Last thing, hold the left bumper to run. Oh, baby. Okay, good luck, buddy. I'm all yours. So how do I... It said left bumper to run. Is this running? Oh, 
boy. Can I b-hop? <laughs> it says the hole. Is this the ship? Where? Are, okay, what's the play here? Oh, can I open this? You found a secret. Check the menu later to see it. What menu? Like the oh, was the menu that little, like that section we were in? It's a note about the hole. Hello and welcome to Nulla Terra. You're in the hole now, a safe space for new visitors. Make yourself comfy and take care. Chief Wolf. Thank you, Chief Wolf. I saved too much. <laughs> Didn't like that. <laughs> oh no. Dude, I... <laughs> I can't get over the sound effect. Bah! Just bopping people. Alright, what's the play? Woohoo! Can I break all these? Yeah! I don't want to save. I'm Bucky the damn beaver. I don't save at all. It says living quarters. Oh, nice. The beach. How's volume, by the way? Game is very quiet on my end. But I don't know if I should... Should I turn it up for y'all? Like... I don't know. Wait, there's people! Chase them down, Bucky. Did you hear about the volcano? You arrived five days before its eruption. You got 120 hours. Is this Majora's Mask? If I were you, I'd use them wisely. Okay. It's really hot out, isn't it? I think it may be the volcano. I just really hope it's not true. I don't want to think about what happened. What's my violence button for? I want to hit somebody. <laughs> Hello. Are you Wally the Walrus? Walter. Walter. Bucky, thank goodness you're here. Bad weather wound you up here too, hmm? This is gonna sound really bad. My boat wound up in a local dam. Can you try and get it unstuck? Just open the gates and we'll be good. Oh, and don't move if it gets dark. It's uh, hard to explain. Do your best. Thanks, Walter. Wait. Walter. Wait, is this a minigame? Hearts. What? Am I winning? Um, what's the red button for? I'm so lost. What are we doing? This is like a checkpoint. I can't open that. I didn't listen to Walter. Going here, maybe? Oh, dang, a Bucky platforming section. Good thing I'm a... No! Oh. <laughs> Good thing I'm good at platforming. What happened? What the hell happened? Why did it do that? <laughs> Why did it do that? I hit a button on my, 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 Steam, my stream deck and it messed up. Get me back in there. Remember, don't move if it's dark. Rooting for you. Wait, what? Oh, that was it getting dark and then I moved. Now I get it. I wanted to see what was in here. Oh! No! Oh! Bucky! I'm going off the rails. What the heck? Uh, I hit the button. I don't know what that did for me. Oh, I bet that did something like give me green mode. Okay. We gotta help Walter. You gotta get his boat back to him. Wait, you mean like... 
Wait, did I do it? Don't fail too many times. What does that mean? Oh, I see what we're doing. Wait, can I wall jump? Oh my god, it's Mario. Whoa! <laughs> I hate this. <laughs> bum, bum, bum. I saw the clock advance when you got hooked. Yeah, there was like a... I guess that's my... My lives advance time. Like if I fail, it'll advance the timer or something. I hope this counts as being still. <laughs> Bucky! Wait, can I do a... Oh, it doesn't... You don't even have to be, like, moving. You can do... Woohoo! <laughs> I, I hate this. Is time advancing? I didn't think I'd have to be like... Whoa, whoa. I didn't think I'd have to be good at the video game. Wait, no, 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 no. Oh. <laughs> nice. If you fall, you fail. I will not fall or fail. I think I win. Onward. Do I lose or win? Free Walter's boat. I did it. I freed Walter Walrus. Victory. Walter's free Walter. Victory for Bucky. That's one of my crewmates saved, right? 9 p.m. Oh, you did it. Thank you so much, Bucky. I knew I could count on you. All right, meet you at the beach. He just, he's out of here. Wow. Walter. I love it. You have to mash to open up like chests. Check the menu later to see it. Yo, secrets. Secrets are in here. Oh, I can't go in there. I took eight hours to free his boat. Listen. Bucky, there's a reason we crash landed on this island, and it could be Bucky's incompetence. Taking eight hours to move a boat down like a canal. <laughs> Hi, Wolfie. You arrive five days before it's... Okay, same dialogue. About the volcano that's about to erupt or something. I'm here for secrets. I'm here to find all these secrets because those are probably more, more interesting. It says theater. Sorry, I have to break these. I don't know if it's loud. Hello. Since you know we're all probably gonna die, I'm spending my last few days here. You know, cozying up, engaging in the arts. It's nice. That's a good play. Although you don't have a screen or anything. There's no screen here. I don't, how are you watching the movie? Hello! You were on the title screen. You must be one of my friends. It's me, Giovanni Goose. Hey, look, what took you so damn long? Get it, damn? Look, wolves have been on my tail all day. Part of my debt is to cook for these mutts. But I can't turn the dials with these wings. They're useless. Okay, get in there, Rodin. Oh no, it's overcooked. Wait, what are we doing? What are we doing? Giovanni? <laughs> Giovanni, your posture is scaring me. We have to make sure- Oh! Keep all red ovens green. We can't burn. If we burn, we die. Oh god, oh god, oh god. We're good, we're good, we're cooking. 
here. Go, 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 go. Giovanni, why did you, why are you a chef if you can't turn on an oven? How did you get out of culinary school? Like, <laughs> how'd you get this far in life and not be able to turn on an oven because you have, like, wings? Surely this world would have made, like, bird, uh, would have considered birds when making ovens. Victory! Bucky wins. I win. Give me my reward. Cook the worst, most vile, disgraceful putrid dish I've ever laid my eyes on. I got an achievement. It said, where's the lamb sauce? You aren't turning them on, you're stopping them from burning? Why did Giovanni start cooking if he couldn't turn them off? You're gonna burn the island down. Smell that? That right there, my friend, is a good meal. I'm impressed. I'll admit, first time, too. All right, see you at the beach. <laughs> the achievement names are so good. I know, I've seen a- I got one for just booting the game up, and it's like- I, I forget what it was, it was like, you fucked up or something. <laughs> um, big mistake, and it just says, uh-oh. What was that, like? Cook the worst, most vile, disgraceful, putrid dish I've ever laid eyes on. Great. Thank you. <laughs> I think they all went to bed. We should try to find a place to sleep. You should go to the hole for now. Oh, is there actually like a day-night cycle in this? Uh-oh. What? Do creatures come out at night? Woohoo! Says the park. I don't want to go there yet. I gotta go to the hole. Well, they did say five days before Doom. You're very right. I got a secret. Check the menu later to see it. Hell yeah. I could- this game is actually, like, really fun. <laughs> the controls feel really good. Walter, we gotta go to bed. The damn volcano is gonna explode. The park, okay. It's a note about the hull. Hello. Oh yeah, we already did this. Make yourself comfy and take care so I can go to sleep here, right? Well, day one. It's been nice having you around. Let's get some more friends tomorrow. Good night, buddy. Am I talking to myself? Day two. Four days remain until the volcano explodes. And I think I'm making good pace. I don't think the volcano is going to explode on my watch because I think we're getting out of here. But we'll see. Because I want to go... Where do we want to go now? The park? Hello. Yeah, let's go to the park. Bucky knows you're controlling him? What the heck? You saying this is some sort of, like, meta game? How'd they do that in 1997? Town Hall. Why is that locked? Hmm. Hello. You were on the main menu. Olive Otter. Hi, Bucky. Thank goodness you're okay. Listen, I'm in a tight situation here. We were sent to gather coconuts for wolves. Does anyone else keep seeing the C's as parentheses and getting, like, really annoyed by them? I keep seeing that. To pay off our debts for the crash. I'm not great at finding things, though. If you can help, I'll be able to leave. They're often hidden in trees or boxes. Hit or interact with those, and you'll get get them. Come on, let's get this over with. Hold up, I gotta fix something, because I, I realize I'm blocking. I'm in the way. There, now I'm a small tuber. I'm tiny man. Coconuts, zero out of 30. We gotta go. Give me that. I'm so sorry. You're the first person I've been able to actually, like, hit. <laughs> I feel bad. I'm sorry. Why is she the only one I can hit? Wow. Gimme, 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 gimme. What other games from aside from Majora's Mask have day limits integrated? Um, there's not a lot. There's... Um... I forget the game on... It's on something. There was a game that was like basically Majora's Mask, but like an indie version of it. Uh, 
on something everyone had like a timer on them that was like how long they had left to live and you had to manage all the npcs i can't remember what it was called unturned maybe no that's the that's the um lethal company developer game oh my god i can shake the trees smack the shit out of these coconuts <laughs> give me these Please. Oh no. <clears throat> Ayo creepy pasta game. This is it. It's very haunted. I gotta get 30 coconuts. Whap, whap. Any any trees? There's these. <laughs> Give me your coconuts. <laughs> Please. Wee. There's Plague Inc. Oh my god, Plague Inc. was such a fun time. That game blew up, didn't it? Didn't it like, didn't it have like a COVID update? Am I crazy? There's no way they like added COVID to that game, right? I remember playing that on like my iPod Touch in like 2008. That was a really fun game. You found a secret, thank you. I'm here for coconuts, not for secrets though. <laughs> okay, boomer. Sorry. Why isn't Ollie Otter, Otter or whatever her name is, why is she not helping? I'm out here beating up every tree in the, the island. <laughs> She's just watching me. Come on, Olive Otter. There's so many trees. I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> I did. Is there like a secret or something for hitting her? I, I would hope not. This game hasn't been very like dark and twisted yet. And I, I'm really... I want to play the original version that they haven't like... Because in the beginning it said you can play the 2023 version, which is this one, which is like cleaner and nicer, or you can play the original. 1997 version which was never released but I think we have to beat this game first <laughs> I got your coconuts now what collect all coconuts for olive otter achievement underscore four seven four two that'll be an important number in the in the future I promise four seven four two write that down Perfect. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'll meet you at the shore. You truly are a hero. I'm just a beaver, ma'am. I'm no hero. <laughs> I love just like flying around. This takes me to the living quarters. Is that like the village area? Yeah. I want to go to the town hall, and then I think I'm, like, done, I guess. I don't know. I just want to know if I miss secrets and things, but I guess I'll learn later. I should probably just play like normal for now. Welcome. Welcome. Um... Hello. <gasps> secret. Give me secret. Hello, who are you? Chief Wolf. Oh, looks like I missed one. Well, hello. Listen, I know it was an accident, but you're scaring our town half to death. I know where your boat is. It's in pieces. There's a forest nearby, Slumber Woods. Go there, get your boat pieces. I'll fix it for you, and you can leave. Now scram. Oh my god. Psst, press the Z button. I don't have a Z button on my controller. You mean... Oh, my sprint button. Oh, dude, I got Bucky Vision. What is that? What is this thing? Hello? <laughs> Hello? Are you a, a villain? I mean, you're red. 
Back up. I got a mean slap. I just punched a bunch of trees. Oh, <laughs> this is goofy ass music. Okay. I tried to punch it. It didn't work. Thrown out, I see. Nice one, dummy. Get me back in there. I want to beat the hell out of that one. I didn't think it would attack me. Dude, this would have traumatized a child. They couldn't have put this on the N64. They would have killed somebody. Don't go after it. That wolf has a scar on the eye. Write that down. Wait, do I have to take them all back individually? Uh-oh. That was too scary. Jump scare warning, guys. This is not a family-friendly game. It's actually a scary game. With blood on the ground. Uh-oh. Wait, is this where I have to take them? Oh, okay, cool. <laughs> it's creeping. Oh, no. This game doesn't scare me whatsoever. Not at the moment, not at all. The jump scare was a little like, oh, I didn't expect that. I don't think it's meant to be really, like, scary. It's more just... Well, I don't know. It's, it's like creepypasta-y, which are scary, but... I don't, I don't know how to explain it. Ah! What are you? Ha! Swiper no swiping can't come in here. <laughs> Got him. Why does the vision sound effects remind me of GTA San Andreas? I don't know. I never played San Andreas. So I wouldn't know. So, I think this is my sprint button, but it's also my vision button. Unless I'm just missing the sprint button. Someone hacked my bank account? Oh, no. That sucks. Hopefully, I hope you can get that fixed. That's like a, a fear. That's scary. I think you're not in this for the jump scares, but for the lore and the secrets. That's why I'm here. I, I love, like... ARGE type stuff. I just want to solve puzzles and like <laughs> I don't know. I want to find links to websites in the video game and go to those websites and explore them and like I love the the puzzle aspect of ARGs. That's my favorite part about it. <laughs> Why did this Wendigo take my boat? MatPat may steal my video. I, I don't know. I don't really... Well, I do care if, like, that were to happen, but I feel like it wouldn't. I don't know. Bum, bum, bum. What if the websites are viruses? That just makes it all the more creepy and scary. I don't know. I, I don't think they would be. One last piece. The one piece. I'm not aware that it comes with a beaver image. <laughs> I don't like the way Bucky, Bucky's head turns like when you turn the camera. I don't know. It just bothers me. I want to see his face, but he's just like always looking away from me when you're running. Why do you have like eight minutes to do this? Because if you actually go over there to the coordinates at the edge of the map, there is a drop-off point that leads to a secret door, which will actually have a picture of the lead developer's corpse in there. It's crazy. That's why they give you so much time to do this part. No, but I, I bet there's like something out there in this map. It feels like a really large amount of time. Oh dear, get out of the woods in one piece, but peace. Oh, never mind. You got your boat back. Hell yeah. Dude, a ghost made this game. I know, it's crazy. It's haunted.
Thank you, Chief Wolf. Got it? Good. Leave it there. I'm gonna fix this hunk of junk. You get out of my face. Do what you gotta do. <laughs> he just disappears. Poof. What's... See, there's all these, like, locked doors. What are you... What's going on in here? Hey. What are you doing? Who are you? Why are you behind bars? Are you in jail? <laughs> Bubni. <laughs> it's a Bununi. Or a Banoi. <laughs> a Bunni. I bet you can clip into the waterfall. The bunny from the introduction video? Was there a bunny? You can just smack doors to go through them? Wait. <laughs> I've been playing the whole game wrong. You can just smack doors to open them instead of hitting X. You can just slap them. I love the slap sound effect. I thought it was the, the Spider-Man getting his uh, ass slap sound effect. It's, it sounds just like it. <laughs> and I don't know if it is. Boing. All right, any secrets of, of, afoot? I thought that was a creature. I'm I'm on the I'm on the def, the, the defense now cuz I saw that little windigo. I'm ready to attack. But I think I think it's time to leave. I, I may have done everything I can. We can get the good ending where Bucky and friends escape. Where does this lead? There's a, a locked door there. Hmm. Bad porn video sound effects. <laughs> All right, friends. To bed. Wait, can I not go to bed? It's like 11 p.m., right? Gang, we're, we're leaving, right? What are we doing? What about blue guy? Will you leave them behind bars? It wouldn't let me get them. Oh! Bucky drowns and dies. The OG game had stuff like going through walls and over them. That might be the more... Well, <clears throat> did the... Did the original game have the choice to choose between, like, the revised version and the older version? Because what I'm assuming is, like, this is the clean version yeah. where they fixed all the weird yeah. bugs where you could, like, clip out of bounds and stuff, and you're just meant to, like, play it through... And then afterward, you go back through and go through the, the cursed version. Oh yeah, what was that bunny doing in this wall, in this room right here? He was just kind of sitting behind. Oh, they're gone now. Hello. What happened to you? Oh my God. What happened to you? Uh, what is this image? It's like two happy bunnies. It's it's him and the other one. What? Hiya, friend. It's Stumbler O'Hare. It's been a while since I've seen anyone. I used to be living in town. Then I was disarmed. <laughs> Lately, though, I've fallen for a rabbit. But I can't just talk to her. I want to draw her instead. Can you come and help me draw? Just keep my paint topped off. And my canvas upright. He's drawing with his bones. Thank you. What? Okay, buddy. You go gather some paint. And I'll get right to drawing. Okay. Why are we in why are we in this cave? Stumbler. Dude, there's secrets in the minigames. Oh man. Tumblr O'Hare. <laughs> I love the like Banjo Kazooie voice acting. It's just bleh, 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 bleh. and then he just has like regular voice acting out of nowhere. Uh oh. Are you good, Stumbler? Oh my god, he's painting with his mouth. <gasps> I'm sorry. I got you. Gotta help our boy out. Ooh. Okay. 
Ink jars. Okay. He's doing. He's still doing fine. So I think we're good. Good to yeah. explore. Yeah, I'm really excited to see the the, the like messed up version. I hope that there's crazy stuff. I want to I want to clip out of bounds and do stuff I'm not supposed to. Uh oh. There you go, buddy. It's all good. Yeah, you can grab onto ledges and, and stuff. It, it has like a weirdly like in-depth control system. Like you have wall jumping, you have like triple jumps. When did Mario 64 come out? Was that before 97 or was that 98? Cuz if this had if this had triple jumping before like Mario 64 did, this game's revolutionary. Crazy. Paint little bunny. Paint completes your masterpiece. <laughs> 1806 is when they put Mario 64 out. Dang. It's a masterpiece. Um, this is the door we came in, right? I don't know if it actually goes anywhere. His drawing sucks. <laughs> Ink jars dispersed deep in a cave. Yeah, like, how did they get here? Why were they already bottled up? Let's see you draw better with the mouth. You're you're very right. If I had two my if my hands were chopped off and I just had bone stumps, I don't think I could be a painter. And I'm and I'm not helping Stumbler O'Hare's career. I'm actually like the I'm I'm the worst type of person to be around him right now. Paint faster. Oh, no, 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 get up, get up. You're good, you're good. It's okay. We're all good. He's doing a decent job. He's actually, like, doing it. Slowly. Okay. <laughs> it's done. Okay. Now what? A happy little accident. Artistic genius in the making. <laughs> I helped Stumbler Stumbler paint. I did it. Don't say that. What did I say? Did I say he was a bad artist? Thank you, Bucky. I'm gonna go hang this up in the theater. Want to come see? Yeah, I would love to. It might be a little late for me, but I would love to come see in the theater. Oh, I said his drawing sucked. I don't know how to feel about his drawing. We'll see the completed thing in the theater. Oh, it's midnight. That means I gotta go to sleep, right? I'm completing the world's first Bucky Beaver Shipwrecked 64 any percent speed run today. I might be the world's first gamer. <laughs> Actually, no, there's probably a bunch of people playing this today, so never mind. Well, day two. It's been nice having you around. Let's get some more friends tomorrow. Good night, buddy. Is he talking to me? Day three. Two days remain. Why does Bucky... Bucky, you go to bed at midnight and you're waking up at like 1 p.m. You don't need that much sleep. <laughs> he's wasting his days away on this like, he's stranded on an island. He's not even like taking the effort to wake up on time. <laughs> he's waking up at like 1 p.m. Dude, what are you doing? You're trying to get off the island. What is this giant temple over here too? I didn't even look at that. There's just this massive building. Is it part of the theater? 
Man, you really made my day. Look at it, isn't it a beauty? When she sees this, she'll be falling into my arms. Or, uh, nubs. Anyways, <laughs> thank you. Seriously, bravo, Picasso. Oh, right. Can you check up on my other paintings, too? Where are they? I left some lying around at the town hall. Thanks. No problem, Stumbler. Is there anyone I can help right now? That's locked. He's on an involuntary vacation. This place... I haven't realized... I didn't realize how, like, big it is. They have... What are those called? I, I want to call them windmills, but they're not, right? Or are they? I don't know. They have those things set up. This is an advanced society on this island. Why are we trying to leave? They clearly know what's going on. They got wind turbines. Yeah, that's the word. Hello. Uh, I'm here to pick up the art. Who are you, though? Hello. JD. Oh, hello. Surprised we haven't met. Pretty bad crash, eh? Heard all about it. You know, I've got a secret. There's actually a whole barge somewhere here. But it's tucked away in a cave. And the only way to it is through the volcano. You've only got one shot, but you can do it. Let me take you there. We can save the island. Or you would. They'd never let little old me do it. Or you would say, oh, I'll save it. Come on, Bucky, we have an island to save. I have one shot at this? Easy. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. I got this. Oh, Bucky! <laughs> okay, we don't die. <laughs> Bucky died. Oh no. <laughs> okay. Best reaction ever. <laughs> I'm like genuinely, I care for Bucky. I don't want to see him die. I'm trying to save the island or something. <gasps> This volcano is going to blow up. Where do I go? How do how do I get over there? Bucky! <laughs> what the hell? Um minor bug. I think I could do that, but this feels like a section you're meant to fail. I don't know. But I wanna- I wanna win. Especially the fact that he's like, you have one shot. That made it seem like it was meant to be... I don't know. Yeah, the whole area does feel like the Great Mighty Pooh a little bit. Ooh! I'm already inventing Bucky Tech over here. Uh oh, this, this is bad. Bucky, what are you doing, man? This is it. This is the run right here. It's all about momentum, speed, and being a platforming god. Ooh! This is not the run. It's the run. It's the run. It's the run. I don't know how long it is, but I think I can do it. Wait, it goes, we go boom, 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 triple jump. And then here you stop, you gotta get like, you gotta get that going, okay. Okay, Bucky. Ooh, where do I go, where do I go from, where do I go from here? Bucky, we gotta save this island. Why is there a ship? Why is there a boat in the lava? What? How does this, is this how does this work? <laughs> I 
They're just trying to waste my time. I gotta beat this. Oh, no. Go, 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 go. Bucky, Bucky, Bucky. We gotta go, man. I know. I was thinking it was gonna be the Super Mario Sunshine, but I don't have a water pack, thank God. What the hell is this? Yeah, you're not meant to do this, right? That's why I gotta do it. Where to? Where to? Where to? <gasps> Wait, why are you here, JD? Oh! Hello. You did it. Good job. Alright. Let's go get that boat. Why are we- why, I thought he said he couldn't be in there. Whatever. Dude, I did it. Look, it's still here and intact. Hey, how do you see that? I can't. Oh, the barge he was mentioning, right? For the love of twigs, it's real. My cat's in the way. I can't see. Um. Well, Bucky, you know what to do. I... I don't know what to do. Bring that boat to the beach. You'll be a hero. So long, buddy. Who is this mysterious JD? A true hero. Save everyone on the island. I did it! Did I get the good-ass ending? I don't feel like I saved them. Okay, no, we're good. Uh, bum, bum. Victory for Bucky and the gang. Shipwrecked no longer. We win. Bum, ba -dum. Bum, ba -dum. And that's Shipwreck 64, except it's not. We gotta play the 1997 version now. Squeaks is the developer. That was fun. I'm Now I wanna get into the real game. Do I recognize any names here? I don't think I would. They all have different voice actors for the different versions of the game. We saved 12 people. Hell yeah. I gotta check out those secrets I found on the, the main menu. And there's probably different endings, because the achievement I got was like... A rare one? 9% of players have it. And I bet there's like a, a normal ending. There's, there's, I'm looking at the achievements. There's bad endings. Ah, Christ. Why was that so loud? Ow. Here, let's do bonuses. Because I, I did find a couple secrets that I can now go into the creepy secret room. And we can look at him, hopefully. The Freddy Fazbear, Golden Freddy. <gasps> oh my god, I hate the hyper-realistic. Look at Giovanni and Bunny. Wait, no, 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 don't fade out. What are you doing? No, 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 I hit A. Oh, it didn't like that. Hold up, I, I found like six secrets, didn't I? I hate the Golden Freddy, like, <laughs> Golden Bucky. This is even worse. I hate this hyper-realistic group photo. Olive photograph SG1996. Dude, that looks like... It looked like when I did... It looked like me. I'm JPEG compressed. <laughs> it's a big-ass compressed JPEG. What is this? The Studio Grounds Vandal. It's Poppy Playtime. That This looks like a real photo. That's like a straight up Coke machine, but with this little blue guy drawn in. And the JPEG compression lets him get away with it too. It looks cool. What is this little guy? I thought that was a butt. Um, Walter poster. Studio Grounds. Oh, that's Walter the Walrus. Our good friend. You can tell by the, the pixels, it's him. 
concept art question mark the boats trees faqs statings hurts harry i can't read it we gotta get an ai upscaler that can remove jpeg compression that guy's speaking backwards it looks like the the mole guy in the bottom right hands harns that's an oven in the top right i can see that how many secrets are there Oh wait, it goes one, one, two, wait, it goes one, two, three. So there's two more after that that I missed. There's one there, there's one there. I missed four secrets. I don't know where they are. I hate this picture so much. This is like uncomfortable. <laughs> Their eyes. Get me out. Get me out. But I bet there's some secret stuff in there. Turn to menu. What is this thing? Oh, it's the music. Okay. So now... Oh, wait. There's a computer I needed to check. But now I should have the other version of the game. This is where we're at. The 1997 version. The game that was removed from shelves. We think outside the box here. It's deeper than you know. I am here for this. Here we go. We get to play the crusty, nasty version of the game. Hey, everyone. They didn't even I chroma key him. Shipwreck was pulled from shelves after three days. Are those actual puppets? The game received many complaints after its launch. Those aren't, that's like a 3D model, right? Oh, this was Cogware's second last game. So what do you say, buddy? Let's go rescue the gang. The gang. Shipwrecked. Is it any different? I think it's the same cartridge. Although it's... Was it redacted originally? Hello. Welcome to Shipwreck 64, 1997. Thank you. This Deltarune intro. Information on the game has been very sparse since its soft launch in 1997. The game would not work on any emulators, but after some tinkering, we built our own for this. <laughs> they made their own emulator to play this. The game was developed by Cogware Games. Two X devs helped us create this version of the game. This game may have some glitches or artifacts. It is not for the faint of heart. What does that mean? Do people get like, am I gonna, are there people that like, if they see a bug, they freak out? Some people do. This is exactly how we found the game. Unaltered. Uh-oh. This is what I'm here for. I'm excited. I wanted to just like mess up instantly. Why did they pull it from store shelves after four days? We gotta know. Hi, Bucky. Oh, hi. Listen, you gotta help me. I was out on the sea with my friends. Yes, yeah, the tutorial. I crashed my boat. It was awful. And my friends were all kidnapped. It was pretty bad, yeah. But you can help, right? Here, let me show you how it works. I know how it works, Bucky. You don't need to tell me. You know, I know you move. Try using the analog stick to move. Okay. You can also press A to jump. When no one's talking, press the green B button to interact. You can also press right bumper to hit. Remember to look for canvases too. You can save on those. Yeah. Last thing, hold the left bumper to run. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, good luck, buddy. I'm all yours. Let's roll. All right, so what's going to be, like, messed up first? I'm excited. I will dredge up the, the, the dang old data. It says the hull. Can I still break the save signs?
That good that that feature's still intact, okay. So when does it get Oh, there is no. I I don't think there was collision. Dang, now I wanna wait, do I Yeah, I'm just gonna like basically replay everything I did and see what changes. Like do I die if I go in the water? Okay, yeah, I figured. I feel like it'll make something really obvious at first, and then I'll I'll go from there based on what it, it shows me. But can I just, like, go wherever? Are the secrets different? Are they the same? They're not even here! Aw. Oh. I was assuming it would be, like, they had to add collision or like invisible walls everywhere. Hmm. Oh, I didn't check over here, did I? I guess I'll just play it like normal and eventually something will be different. Check every single door. Oh, that's a lot of doors. I'll talk to Walter. Thank goodness you're here, Bucky. Bad weather sucks. This is going to sound really bad. My boat wound up in a local dam. Can you try and get it unstuck? Just open the gates and we'll be we'll be good. Oh, and don't move if it gets dark. I won't. I gotta search for the fucked up stuff creatively. That's what it said. It said think outside of the box. Wait. I'm out the box. Ooh. Oh. Bucky, no! Huh? <laughs> Hold up. <laughs> I don't know if it, like, wants me to go out of bounds. I don't actually know. There's a big button over there. I can't move. And it, it wants me to stand on that... I feel like I shouldn't be doing this. Oh. <laughs> Maybe I can see something that I wasn't able to before doing this. I don't know. It's cool that you can just clip out of bounds for that, though. If nothing happens, eventually I'll push you in the right direction. That's what I... I, I think I'm just going to, like, play normally and then keeping my eyes out for just anything weird. How do you get back down? Boom, 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 boom. Let's go, Bucky. Let's go, Bucky. Wah! Ooh. There was a door I could never go in that I wanted to, to go into. Hmm. We'll see. I, I noticed there's no nighttime. Is this, is this, just, <laughs> my mouth. Does that just not work anymore? They didn't finish implementing nighttime in this one? It's okay. It's a tricky concept. Oh. Never mind. They implemented nighttime. I, I spoke too soon. I almost want to die and see what happens. Wee. I think it'd be let's see do, what happens is it the same oh oh my god Bucky no <laughs> anything like fricked up happen those hooks are sharp huh okay never mind nightmare time uh oh yeah why is God fishing me I don't know I love how fast you can move. You can get zooming. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, 
I want to become a buck. Oh, a shipwreck 64 speedrunner. Boom. Any percent the Walter level speedrun. I'm going. What the hell is that? Walter. Is that you, Walter? Um. My controls are reversed now. Wait, no, they're, they're just weird. Why, why can't I? What is going on? <laughs> why, why is my left and right reversed? Walter. Stop. This sucks. The... Ooh. Some fucked up shit is happening, Walter. Pets Cop reference? I don't know anything about Pets Cop. It always seemed like a cool concept. Just the idea of... I don't know. I've never... <laughs> I'm not a big, like, let's play person, so I don't really, like, sit down and watch silent playthroughs of games, but it, it always looked interesting. Oh. Nighttime never ends here, does it? Whoa! I wonder if there was a- was that like an- I, it's a dumb question to ask, like, was that a bug? Like, when the game's intentionally meant to be buggy. This door really sends you, like, a whole half foot- my controls are reversed again! <laughs> Stop! Hey, let's get a good look at, at Walter over here. Make it nighttime. There is no wall. There never was. Scary. I. Oh. Oh. Can you get a better view of it over the wall? I guess I could. I don't think there's anything there. Like maybe there is. I'm just scared of falling and, and dying. Oh. What's up, gamers? It's boundary break. We take the camera anywhere we want. Oh. What was that? <laughs> what the hell was that? There was like a head out there. It's gone. What do you mean it's gone? Is there a person up there? Stop reversing my controls game. It's the head from the title screen Easter egg? The dude? Maybe. There's like a, what is that up there? That's like a, a Mario Galaxy, like, dude in the distance looking at you, right? Hello. I guess I could get over there technically, couldn't I? I don't know how I, I'd get up to that, but I can go up there. I can't get back in bounds. That's the wind to go. Uh oh. No, Bucky! Oh. Oh, sh wait. So you don't die? Oh, thank God. I wanted to go into that little room. Hi. I hate that. I don't know what the hell that is, and I hate it. <laughs> 
I hate that so much. Okay, you can, like, I should have a controller on screen to like show that my controls are reversed because it's really weird. It's really frustrating. <laughs> when it goes called Harns. Harns. Oh, I wouldn't be able to see it. Okay, so I, I can't see that creature. I wonder if they only spawn if you're not looking. So, so like, you have those moments where you turn the camera and you just catch them in the corner of your eye. Let me see if I can get Walter to spawn again. This is an interesting little game. Oh. Walter. So if I go over here, Walter appeared when you were looking? Oh, man. Maybe it's just like random or a distance thing. I don't know. I'm also curious about, I'll show you in a second. I need to, I need to go dark again. Nope, he's not even here. This game's quite buggy. What were they thinking? Um, oh, my controls. Ooh. Uh, the, the room, there's a room like above me right now, and I'm wondering if it's even worth getting into. Oh, I can't clip through the wall. I keep expecting whenever I do like a ledge grab like that, that I'm gonna do like a Mario 64, just like climb through the wall. But I think I'm, I'm good. At the moment, I, I feel like there was not much else to find. At least stuff that was obvious. I don't know. If AVGN played this, he would say, the game freaking reverses your controls. What the frick? Because nowadays you can't swear. <laughs> but yeah, if he, if he played, dude, this would have straight up been like an AVGN game where he'd just been like, yeah, great job, developers. The controls reverse after it becomes daytime. What were they thinking? <laughs> Come on, developers. What were you thinking? We're good. I freed Walter's walrus. I freed the Walter walrus. Now what? We can go... I don't know what we do now. Oh, you did it. Thank you so much, Bucky. I knew I could count on you. All right, meet you at the beach. Thanks. Still not getting the why they pulled this one from shelves. I mean, there are a couple creepy faces everywhere, which I get it. It's, it's very scary. So far, it's not, not too bad. Hello. It's really hot out, isn't it? I think it may be the volcano. I just really hope it's not true. I don't want to think about what I, what happened. Me neither. Check every house. Is it... Can I even, like, check them? It wouldn't let me interact with them ever. Like, they don't do anything. At least most of them don't. There's probably, like, a single one I can interact with. I wonder if it would give me a hint for that if... If that was a thing. But I'm smacking every house. They don't they don't do nothing. Dude, that'd be like the ultimate gaslighting campaign. I would do developers should do this. They should release demos of games that have like cool secrets in them, right? Then in the full version, get rid of all of those. Get rid of all those secrets so people that are like, I watched a playthrough of the demo a year ago. Uh there's a secret here. They can't do that because they're, they're gone. That's like another... I'd, I would add another layer to this. I, I would love that. All the secrets that you thought were there, they're gone. This is a different game. Oh, I'm just waiting for the next show. There's one about a beaver I like. You know, you look a lot like him. You're lucky. Thank you. Okay, Giovanni. Anything different? He's not even talking to me. There we go. Uh, what took you so damn long? Look, wolves have been on my tail all day. 
part of my debt is to cook for these mutts. So we gotta cook for him, right? This was the easy minigame. And hopefully it's not fricked up or anything. I don't know what would be messed up in this one. It's such a small room. Uh, oh. I wonder if there's anything like special you can do in this. But I'm popping off. Oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> whoa, 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 whoa. Got it. Yeah, I'm wondering if, like, if I do fail. I want to just play it through like I did before, and then we can experiment with, like, messing up. Like, what happens if you do something wrong, or... Is there a combination? Is there like a weird secret thing? Yeah, can I just like break out of that? Smell that? That right there, my friend, is a good meal. I'm impressed, I'll admit. First time, too. Alright. <laughs> oh, they have dialogue for if you do it on the first try. That's cool. Yeah, let's do a bad playthrough afterward. Because I probably want to get the the good in ending again. There's There's a bad ending where people die. I don't even know how you would get that. Do you just fail a bunch and then lose? It says the park. What if I stay out too late? Will people get pissed at me for that? It says KBZFQ2 QPPN1. Is that like a... Okay, don't... What? Okay... Ooh. What happened? Hello? It's the guy! <laughs> okay. KBZFQ2QPPN1. I feel like you could translate that. That feels like a Caesar Cipher thing. Um. Caesar Cipher? Solver? Bum, 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 bum. Um. What was it? KBZFQ2QPPN1. Brute force, decrypt it. I got nothing. <laughs> but it probably will be important, so I'm going to write it down. Or keep it for later. I forgot the first number we had. Was that the bunny we saw in that realistic-ass photo? Town Hall. Wait, was that bunny this bunny? This guy? He's not here. Dude, I bet he's not even in this version of the game. Oh no, it's nighttime. Never mind. They go to bed. And so should I. I want to go in that door, but I think that might be the door to the cave. I voted for keep exploring. <laughs> That's the plan. It says the beach. I need to go there. Mm. 90 night. Well, day one. It's been nice having you around. Let's get some more friends tomorrow. Good night, buddy.
Let's try to go for the good ending, though. I want to... Yeah, I want to do, like, the volcano thing again, almost. I don't know. There's, there's a lot that I want to do with this at the moment. Uh-oh. Bum, 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 bum. Hello. Whap. Um... You found the code? What was it a cipher? Whoa. Was I able to pause before? I think I tried to before and it didn't work. Was it not a Caesar cipher? Because I threw it into it and I didn't get any results or anything. It definitely like looks like a Caesar cipher. Whoops. Um. K B Z F Q two Q P P N. Oh, it's not a Caesar cipher. It's just an alphanumeric one. Or not alphanumeric. It's like a. No, that's C Caesar. It's like a shift cipher. Same thing. Rotate 13, um, rotate 5, 18, 47. This pause song is slow and bad, I know. It is just like a, a shift cipher though, right? Sorry, I should probably put this on screen, but I'm, I'm just fiddling with it. Because it totally makes sense that it would be some kind of cipher. Especially the like the layer 2 room 1 thing. I just like solving it. I don't know what to do with that information either. I don't know what the hell that means. Yeah, it, none of the Caesar cipher stuff works there. So I have no idea what that is. It's not a cipher outside of the game if you're wondering. Okay, neat. That is cool. Hello. Looks like I missed one. Listen, I know it was an accident, but you're scaring our town half to death. I know where your boat is. It's in pieces. Bits and pieces. There's a forest nearby, Slumber Woods. Go there, get your boat pieces. I'll fix it for you, and you can leave. Now scram. Press the Z button. Oh, I gotta do all this again? Oh, man. It's on the stream chat in Discord. Was it something I could have found? Why is the Wendigo green? Oh, no, it's not. Or, oh, I forgot his name. Boing. Hmm. What if you can pause on dark mode? Maybe. There's a sign up there. Can you do, like, platforming to get up here? There, there's like 100% something in this area. This area is way too big for there to be nothing in it. <laughs> I just don't know what to do with it. Is the audio that plays when you hold the trigger down important? It sounds like a message. <laughs> I don't like you. I just threw the code onto the multi decoder site. I found it, so it's nothing special. What was it? It like looks like a Caesar cipher because it has those two P's that would go to the O. Maybe I just didn't do every combination or something, or I missed it. Wee. 
What the hell does that mean, though? That doesn't mean, like, anything to us at the moment. Like, layer two, room one. No idea what that means. And it was locked, too, so it didn't matter. Well, I guess we'll get... We'll figure that out as we go. Hello. I'm just collecting parts. Don't mind me. <laughs> He's a sad boy. Oh, no. Wouldn't recommend using outside ciphers. I will try not to. Boing. I feel like it's almost going to be a while before I even see anything. If I play it like this. But also, I, I just like... I don't need a hint from you guys. I would need a hint from the game. But I don't know if there are those. He can't go into the sea bear circle. Nope. <laughs> I drew it perfect. So we're good. Oh. This way. Boing. I wish this game had BLJs so I could like launch myself and, and align my QPUs differently. That'd be crazy. <laughs> I want to align my QPUs with uh, different parallel universes. <laughs> Hello, are you a friend? I also don't know if there's, um, do the secret chests despawn or are they just not in this version? That's what I've, I've been confused on. Like, should I be looking? There's probably like secrets out here somewhere, right? How big is this map? It's, it's massive, right? Because I didn't really explore this map at all and I, I wanted to explore it with the, the six minutes they gave me. They probably despawn. That's what I'm guessing. And I don't know if... Are there even... <clears throat> if I get a secret in the 1997 version, is it going to carry over and be the same? No, wait. Actually, there's the menu. Yeah, they all go to the menu, which isn't part of like the either versions of the game. It's kind of a separate thing. So they should be in both. Did I see it right there? Was that what I thought I saw? <laughs> yeah, I don't know where the secret would be here. I think I'm just going to move on from this. It's creepy. I did it. I win. You got to watch for rolling rocks and half an A press. <laughs> Certain chests can be only found during certain days, which were they? That would make sense. And I, I only did three days. Good. Leave it there. I'm going to fix this hunk of junk. You get out of my face. Do what you got to do. Is the bunny here? There he is. Hello. Yeah, I wasn't sure if this was like a, a Majora's Mask situation where different people spawn on like different days different things happened on different days because if i go back in now right the bunny will be yeah he'll be there hello hi a friend it's been a while since i've seen anyone can't just talk to her. Yeah, he's got his, his bunny girlfriend. Want to draw her instead. Can you come in and help me draw? Yeah. Just keep my paint topped off. 
and my canvas upright. Thank you. Okay, buddy. You go gather some paint. Okay, then buddy. I'll write the drawing. <laughs> so far, though, I don't know why this was was pulled from shelves. That doesn't seem to be anything like too fricked up or anything. Do 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 do. Yeah, aside from the scary faces, that's like it. Unless I'm I'm missing stuff. I got you, stumble hair. You're good. Don't you worry, buddy. I want to turn the corner and just have something like messed up around one of these corners. It's like boo. Did I scare you? Alright, I found something messed up. I'm stuck. <laughs> We're good. Whew. <laughs> almost, almost got stuck there forever. Stumble hair sounds like a ban ban. It does. I love that people call them ban bans. It's, it's just like a perfect way to describe those characters. They're not even like characters from ban bans. They're just like they're they look like ban bans to me. Boing. Wow. Oh, secret. You found a secret. Wait, I already found that one, I thought. Maybe there's extra secrets. Oop. Hmm. Okay, I did it. Oh, I got you. You're good. Is the blood circle in the woods? The what? With the boat, you're saying? Oh yeah, the who are you running thing from Game Boy, the Game Boy camera. I remember seeing that. Was that the video? I had it on in the background. There was like that um, iceberg of, of scary... Was it creepypastas? No, it was like weird Easter eggs and stuff, right? I remember putting that on when I was home for the holidays. And that was one of the things that came up. That like, who are you running Game Boy camera thing. Come on, help him. Or why are you running? I don't know which which it is. The, the, uh, there's just so much time to do stuff that makes me think I gotta do other things in these sections. And I'm betting there's a way to break out of each of each of them. I bet there's there's gotta be a way to like clip out of each of these sections. Oh no. Bum, 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 bum. Whoop. Oh, is there a way to like end this one quicker? I don't think there is. Okay. It's done. It's done. He's done it. I've helped Stumbler paint. Beautiful. Okay, so I'm kind of confused at this point. I've always wanted to try going through that door just to see what would happen, but I feel like it just would end the... I don't know what it would do, actually. I assume it would just take you out here again. I'm gonna go hang this up in the theater. Wanna come see? Yeah. Hmm. <laughs> Where's this? I guess it doesn't matter. <laughs> I can't get over that. You can just like pa slap doors to open them. I love that. <laughs> nice of you to just crash in like that. We're all trying to live our lives. If you want to keep yours, then leave. You wouldn't want to stay here too long. Okay. I don't think I talked to them in the first game. The beach. 
Oh, there was that one video. This this is probably like the only messed up part. Hey, there's Olive Otter. Let me explore a little bit. Exit the room to come back and see if the guy is there. Yeah, maybe he's there just like now. That would that wouldn't I don't know. Would he be there now? Nah, I think he shows up the next day. Um, um. Whap. Um, Could go help Olive Otter out, or I can't go that way. There's a door over here, too. I was wondering about this one, too. I bet it's... It says... KBZQFQ2 QPPN3, which was like... I, how am I supposed to know how to translate that? Because... Um... Drifties, you were saying there's a way to know in-game? Like, I know what it translates to at this point, but I don't know what it means, but also I don't know how you're supposed to decode it. Yeah, it's layer two, room three, but... Um, don't quite know how you would... Like, Drifty was, Drifty's was saying there's stuff in-game. You'll find it out eventually? Okay. Hello. Man, you really made my day. Look at it. Isn't it beauty? Yeah, it's alright. When she sees this, she'll be falling into my arms. Or, uh, nubs. Anyways, thank you. Seriously, bravo, Picasso. Oh, right. Can you check up on my other paintings, too? I left some lying around at the town hall. Thanks. And this is when that guy spawns in, right? Wait, so can you do... Hmm. Can you just do the ending of the game this quickly? Like, I can just leave right now. Because the JD guy will be there, right? JD feels like he doesn't belong either. This guy is sketchy. Hmm. Let's try to rescue everyone. I mean, would I need to? Why do we need those coconuts? I want to talk to him, too. Slumbini! Hello. How's it going? Hello. Surprised we haven't met. Pretty bad crash, eh? I heard all about it. You know, I got a secret. There's actually a whole barge somewhere. Can I just, like, leave? I feel like there's gonna be something in this game. The fact that you can move while you talk to people. <laughs> What, is he going to get mad if I left mid-conversation? I hope not. Did they change the latency on YouTube streams? I don't think so. Hello, Olive Otter. Thank goodness you're okay. Listen, I'm in a tight situation here. We were sent to gather coconuts for wolves. I'm not great at finding things, though. If you can help, I'll be able to leave. They're often hidden in trees. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Time to get coconuts. I don't think they changed the, the latency on YouTube streams. It's, it's been the same. Is it like behind or? You gotta move. I, I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm just trying to get the coconuts out. That was like 15 seconds from when I did it. Did I screw it up? Is it not on like good latency today? Oh, it seemed like I instantly responded. Boom, I'm just on top of it. I don't know. I don't think they've changed anything on the, the latency side at all.
You gotta move, <laughs> please. Can you tell where these are gonna drop from? I feel like if I ever edit this down, I'm like skipping the last hour. I don't even know. There hasn't really been anything interesting. And it's probably my fault because I have to get creative and think outside the box like it said. Oh, what the hell? <laughs> What's going on here? <laughs> oh. Skipping every woman's slap. It was just all of otter, and it's all accidents. Oh, <gasps> button. Oh, it just... <laughs> it just opened up a tab of my Chrome. <laughs> just opened up a tab of YouTube real quick. That was unexpected. Here is, uh, this is, uh, Dancing in the Dandelions by P.T. Cogware. How were they uploading to YouTube in 1997, nine months ago as well? Very scary. It's muted, sorry. What? I don't know what that word that is. Okay, so... Oh... I gotta jump on this house. Look at this! Wait, does this channel have anything, anything else on here? We're in the ARG! We're in! They forgot to... Oh my god, these are... Were these from the original? Crash. What does Crash get me? Keep playing, okay. Uh, you need to stop telling me what to do, please. <laughs> I'm enjoying this the way I want to enjoy it. I'd appreciate it if you don't tell me what to do. I'm having fun with this. I apologize if you're, you're not enjoying watching, but I am. I'm having a lot of fun. Game timer's running out? You're so right. I'll fail. It's okay. We, get, we got days to go. What is this? Is this from, like, the original? It's nine months ago. <laughs> Mods! <laughs> How does this crash? I'm about to put it on 1.5 times speed. Wait, I did this almost. What the? <laughs> Can I do that? Oh my god, it's so crusty. I love it. Yeah, I want to look into other videos on that channel in a moment, but I want to go to that uh, that spot. Oh, it's nighttime. I got to go to bed now. I got to go back to that, that spot with the red circle. That's big. I don't know what the heck that meant. That was Hearns on the boat. We'll get a better look at that. I want to go back to that on a on a separate playthrough, I guess. I might have to start fresh. Wow. <laughs> From the top rope. <laughs> bedtime, bedtime, bedtime. Looks like you accessed the title screen room, screen room from Walter's minigame. Was it? it? I think the game crashed. But we'll see. I'm just interested in seeing what that red circle leads to. I did not expect a, like a random button to just open up a chrome tab. <laughs> That's so weird. <laughs> okay, so she should be here, right? Awesome. Hello. I'm not here for your coconuts. I'm here to do a secret. <laughs> Out of my way. 
bum ba dum bum bum ba dum ba dum bum bum Let's see. So it said it was like up there, right? Can I not? Oh man. Maybe I can. What? How do I get up there? It's it's right there. <laughs> wall jump between the house and the wall? I tried to, it wouldn't let me wall jump. I'm mashing A, it won't let me. And it wouldn't let me climb up when I, I grabbed the ledge there. No! Oh, use her to help? Yeah, she's... she doesn't exist. Oh, this is probably it. Then I can... No, I can't... Um... Did it explain in the video? It didn't, right? Oh, you can't pause here. Can he clip out somewhere? That's what I'm thinking. Gotta think outside the box. Now I can wall jump. <laughs> Why can't I get on this house? This goofy game. Why did it tell me to go over there if I can't get there? Or is there just a way to clip out that I'm not seeing? <laughs> did you do owlless in this? <laughs> get it! Oh. Uh, um. Can I just walk through a wall? Try near the beach slide part? Like this, you're talking? Or the other part? Is that a place that's in bounds? In like the real island? I almost want to watch the video again. Hmm. Goofy Bucky. Maybe you can like go around a wall there? Maybe. It's too long. <laughs> hmm. Weren't you saying like do good first and do bad later? Is this a bad ending? I don't know what this was. This looked interesting. <laughs> Can't land on that. I want to. I gotta pull up the video again. Pull up the the, the dang shipwrecked PT Cogware dancing in the dandelions. Is there any any? Games hit different in 1997. Is there... It zooms in... Yeah. Theft King left a comment. Oh my god, that is Theft King. <laughs> this is like... Oh, this is seven hours ago from Theft King. Beautiful. Very cool. Theft King's gaming. Cool. Oh, whoops, I forgot to get rid of it. I don't know what Theft King is talking about, though. It's like... It's a hint and all, but it doesn't... 
it doesn't work. Fix your game cogware software. <laughs> Fix your out of bounds secrets. Hmm. Their game's too good. Think outside the box. I'm gonna think outside the bun. Um, because... I don't know, I have no idea. Why does this work? If I... It wants me to get, like, up, up there, right? Or at least it was it was pointing at that when it zoomed. What the hell? <laughs> I've been trying to do this for like five minutes. Why did it just now work? Wait, what do I do now? I think I, think I gotta do some platforming. But I don't have time. We take the camera anywhere we want. Oh, shit. <laughs> Basically, we take the camera wherever the heck I want. No. No. Oh. <laughs> Sad boy clipped out of bounds. I'll get it this time, though. Oh. What is this? What happened? Hello? Oh, is it is it a, a movie about, like, your sins? You clipped out of bounds. How dare you? The label says Olivia's last phone call. All, or call. Who's Olivia? We are not available now. Please leave your name and phone number after the beep. We will return your call. You showed up at the door again. It's quiet. I don't know what to do. Something about us and the... <laughs> Olivia is dead. Is this a dang FNAF situation? Oh. I don't know what to do. Hello? Jump scare. <laughs> They, did you see him? He creeped in on me. He came out of my dang 4 by 3 bars. Is there, like, the cartoon character came to life? Heh. <laughs> Whoops. Guess we're both not great at finding. That's okay. We can always go again. I'm really glad. I, I usually, when I have, like, a 4 by 3 game, I'll... You know, like crop the the bars away so I can just move it around freely. I'm very glad I didn't do that for this because I didn't know there'd be stuff in like the bars. I love that they're fake. Um, was that the secret though? I'm shards of glass were stuck everywhere. A thick trail stretched from the broken window, and it led directly into the water. Oscar, Lima. India, O L I, I bet it says Victor, yeah, Olive, Olivia. Are the characters. Oh, that's from Losing Twice? Oh. Oh, and it's different now. There's no trees. I should lose more. I gotta be worse at the game. So, okay, this is game theory. Uh, the otter's name is Olive, which is close to Olivia. Do you think the developers got put in the game as the characters? Game theory. Um, watch this. This is Gamer. No! It's kind of hinting at it when I said don't lose too much. It kind of... Oh! 
makes sense now. I can see why you didn't want me to lose. What is it? Want me to get here? There was like a, a spot. It said... Go right here, right? Did it not? I gotta bring up the dang footage. <laughs> this noise. Uh-huh. Is it further back or something? Like, maybe it's just in the back of that area? Because I'm at that spot. Is there a fake wall there you can jump up to? I don't know. Is it in the wall? Whoa! Try slapping that spot behind the pillar. Which one? The thing with the slap is I forgot it even existed. <laughs> I'm just confused on what to do with it. How did I even do this jump? Get it! No! No! Okay, got that. Is there any... There doesn't seem to be anything. Oh, maybe I would hit X on just like a random spot. I'm not, I, that's what I haven't been doing. I haven't been hitting X. And that's my interact button. And there's maybe like a button. A button or something right here, maybe. Yeah, it seemed more like right here. Because... Like, it seems like it's in the middle of that, like, up there, right? Yeah. Would be easier if there's a sprite that indicated what you can interact with. I don't know if it is an interaction thing. Can I slap him midair? I can't. I also don't know if it's just pointing all the way over here. I don't know. What if it's demo exclusive? Why would it link? Why would it open the... It opened that YouTube video when I hit the button, though. Is it in the 2023 version only? <laughs> like, what is it? What is it supposed to be? Which house did it line up with? That's a good question. I'm pretty sure it was the, the left one. Here's a... It's the left house. Why is the bunny here? What's up with that? What's up with the bunny? <laughs> that noise. Does it say to do anything with it? Or... Dancing in the Dandelions. Games hit different in 1997. Glad I found that. I remembered the hint from one of the trailers months ago. Thank you, Theft King. I feel like the bunny is important. Yeah. 
Yeah, because the bunny was like, hey, go check out my paintings, and then JD's there, too. And JD is how you beat the game? Jump into the water. Die. Ocean. Do all the mini games get m more and more messed up the more you die in them? Oh, I didn't like that. Oh, no. I mean, the bunny is the one in the real world killing people, right? No, it's... That's Bucky. Oh, the ceiling's gone. Did it decrease the timer? What the hell? <laughs> Bucky, what are you doing? What'd you do to her, Bucky? Hey. Hey, me. Hey, hey. You killed Olive. It's like an allegory for real life. The bunny killed Olivia in real life. No, sorry, Bucky in real life killed Olivia. Is that why this happened? Because I hit her? Uh-oh. It didn't like that, did it? Oh, she's gone. <laughs> I think she's dead. Uh, uh-oh. I say you definitely reset the 0%. That's what I'm thinking. The beach. Yeah, maybe I failed it too many times. I don't know what happened there. I could also get the bad ending real fast. Like, we can... Well, actually, it's kind of hard to get the bad ending. Test the crash thing with Walter? The problem is I can't go back. I have to restart from the beginning to do that. And I guess I... Can... Is there a quick and easy? What does respawn do? Oh, neat. Wow. Bing bong. Walter's mini game. Hello. I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do JDs real fast so we can just like reset. We have an island to save, Bucky. I'm on it. I'll beat this without ever dying. Ooh. And then we can go back, we can test like the crash thing. We can do a lot of stuff. You think Olive is dead? Oh no! I'm not dead, I'm fine. Whatever. Olive's like dead dead. She died. Because Bucky in real life killed Olivia, and the when you die in the video game, you die in real life. Every time I die and fall into the lava, someone dies in real life. Scary. Hmm. Oh shoot. This minigame looks the same, sort of. I don't think it changed at all. This is one that, like, JD said if I failed it once, it's just over. <laughs> Such a cheery little game. <laughs> Very fun. That's not true? I thought he said, like, if I failed it, you, you, I got one shot at this, right? You can probably get a true bad ending where you take it so everyone's dead and I, I leave alone. I, mean, I probably could. How is there a boat in lava? Um, Super Mario Sunshine. Checkmate. I don't know. Especially like a wooden boat. I don't know how that works. Who? Oh! Easy. Bucky? Oh, I swear to God. Sometimes he just doesn't want to cooperate. I did find some new secrets, I think, too, right? I found like one. Oops. Ah. 
Good job. All right. Let's get to go get that boat. <laughs> Does Bucky auto grab ledges? Yeah. There's no button for it. He'll just like grab it. Look, it's still here and intact. What if I die in this section? What happens? What if I fall into the water and drown? Oh. <laughs> Expecting. I'm thinking outside the box. No, it does feel like the only up auto grab, and I hated the, I hated only ups auto grab. It was the most clunky thing ever. Oh, this is just the bunny in disguise, and it took me too long to to realize that, right? Is it the bunny? I mean, he has his arms back, so it couldn't be. Is it the bunny? Yeah, the bunny doesn't have hands. Bring that boat to the beach. You'll be a hero. So long, buddy. I did it. I saved the day again. So now what? So many options. Uh-oh. I'm caught up. Welcome to the scariest game of all time, where I've kind of done the same playthrough twice on accident, but next playthrough will go hard. JD doesn't go with you? I'm telling you. JD's not real. Or he's a fake bunny. It's the bunny in disguise. Maybe it's bunny's father's spirit. Oh, lore. <laughs> There's probably some like fake names in this in these credits that you can use for something. Let's go see those secrets. Let's go see if we found any new secrets. Ah, that fucking noise, man. It's so loud. Why is that? That, is, that alone is like the only loud part in this game. It's just... <laughs> oh, the kitties. I have one cat in my lap right now. She's sleeping. Gallery. How do I unlock the gallery? All right, any new secrets? Any new cool moves? Group photo. Oh, we got the Stumbler O'Hare. Concept art. I can't believe that they decided to make him armless. Stumbler O'Hare. This is Stumbler O'Hare, right? Who is this? The Studio Grounds Vandal. Is this JD? Because he's got hands. Well, they look like gloves. They look like stitched on. Am I crazy? That's like a mole. Yeah. I think that's JD. Right? The ears kind of match. Yeah, it has like Coke machines on the left. I think it's like an office. Oh, well, it's a studio ground. Walter in the studio grounds. Concept art? I have no idea what these say. Trees. Ink. Boats. Stations. Harns. Hands? I still don't know what his name is. Liz. There's a note from Liz that says something time. Uh, at the very top. Slip. Squidward time. I don't know what it says. And then there's like a backwards. This is backwards for some reason. I can't read it. I guess I could just take the... That's the dang mole! I, it's JD. Oh, yeah, shipwreck time. Duh. What does this say backwards? If I... Bottom says, ooh, scary. It looks backwards, though, because like, that looks capitalized, the far right letter on it. Let me flip it. 
Never mind, that's gibberish. It says, whoop, skaboop. <laughs> yeah, I think you're right. It just says, ooh, scary. All right, we didn't find any new secrets. We found, well, we found one. I think JD is our mole. Literally mole. What is this? I haven't interacted with this thing. It's just a picture of a computer? I don't understand. Who is Liz? Liz B. Liz B. Liz B. Do we know a Liz? Make your choice. 1997. What about scary man named backwards? Whose name? Oh, hey, scary! Everyone. I need your help. I'm gonna skip the cutscene. I don't think that one's important. Okay, so... What? We, we have, like, hints of stuff. I think we should kill people? <laughs> Hello, Bucky Beaver. I think we should... Oh. Whoops. I think we should go for a bad ending? Yeah, we should start losing some minigames. Because... It, when you died, it changed the minigame. You got a new cutscene with, like, new lore and stuff, right? Bum, 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 ba -dum, bum, bum. Hello. Walter Walrus. Bucky, thank goodness you're here. Bad weather wound you up here too. Why am I reading this? I've already read it. Start with Olive again. Trust me. I'll start with Olive again. <laughs> I love you can just walk away while talking. It's, it's really funny to me. Although I can't... Oh, go on, go in the door. Yes. No, I screwed it up. Oh. That's why the giant faces were appearing on that second playthrough. Because I died here. And um, that was like the messed up version. Yeah, I should be able to get the olive on the, the first day. Oh, I gotta, I gotta actually start. Whoops. Bum, bum, bum. Yippee! Where am I? What am I doing? I went the wrong way. <laughs> if I go here, it should make like the nighttime happen, right? There's a secret for doing Olive before some other people. Okay. I mean, I can go do it after this, right? Stop moving. No. Wait, it didn't kill me. Why did it? Oh, whatever. Is that why my controls were messed up too? Because I was on like the... the degrading version of it or something. Hmm. Oh no. Oh! <laughs> oh no. There's a secret for doing Olive before some other people. Do you think it mattered what like day it was? Hmm. What a weird game. <laughs> I, lo I love stuff like this, but I'm I'm just trying to think about like everything I can do and I'm overwhelmed. Oh, she's never mind. I thought her dialogue was messed up. Thank goodness you're okay. I'm in a tight situation. We were sent to gather coconuts for wolves to pay off our debts for the crash. If you can help, I'll be able to leave. They're often hidden in trees or boxes. Hit or interact with those and you'll get them. Yes. There's nothing different in the dialogue, right? 
Yeah, I'm gonna... Is that why... I couldn't do it because I failed once, maybe? Yeah, I need to lose three times. Oh, I gotta do that crash with Walter, don't I? Forgot to do that. I still don't know what this is. I don't know why it was pointing to that spot in particular, and it, it's kind of annoying me. <laughs> oh, can I not get back in bounds? Uh oh. Not good. Wahoo! Sploosh. Can you punch midair? No, it doesn't let you. If I hit her, does it, do I lose time? You do! This was something I was just thinking in my head. That it seems like there's a way to speed up every minigame. Like, there's a way to instantly end them and fail them. Um, yeah, whoops. Guess we're both not great at finding. That's okay. We can always go again. Yeah. Um, what if you have to find the other first or something? Yeah, maybe it's a sequence of things? I don't know. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed with, like, stuff I want to do, but I will have her die. <laughs> I'm the bad guy. I'm just comforting my friend. Just patting her on the back. Oh no. And then it sends me to the the realm. Can I skip this? Do I have to watch this every time? Please leave your name and phone number after the We will return your call. You showed up at the door again. I, I don't know what to do. Something about us and the Oh! <laughs> Why does this remind me of- Oh my god. The Bucky- The re like the real life Bucky looks like JR from that one fan game, right? Five Nights at JR's or whatever. <laughs> You see me creeping. Oh, scary. Makes the ending to Olive make more sense whenever you beat her up. What now? Oh, the fact that like she's dead in the, the pool. Yeah. It looks like the rat from Five Nights at Candy's. There was a, a secret in my friendly neighborhood that like, I'm pretty sure featured that rat for some reason. And I, I still don't know why. Bad guy. <laughs> I think she said it's at the door again. Or maybe she's stuck at the door again. Uh oh. Bucky, what the heck, man? You can't do that, bro. Oh. <laughs> You can't kill all of the otter. Is this- am I playing as the murderer? I'm- I'm so curious on like what the- the ARG, like, the story within the, the game, or like outside of the game is. Clearly there's- there's a murderous... critter going around? Midnight already? Aw oh, man. I gotta go to bed now. But I don't I don't know who these people are that are dying. Are they developers? Are they just people? I don't know. Someone inside of the Bucky suit is murdering employees. Why do they have a suit? Oh I guess it makes sense. That's what the, the commercial at the beginning. 
Hmm, who could it be then? The people dying are probably humans. We're getting closer to solving this caper. Is that the word for it? Caper? We're gonna solve this mystery. We're getting one step closer. We're narrowing it down. They were human. FNAF had a crazy yeah. influence on yeah. horror. Yeah, it did. It's hard to like, like any animatronic or like person in a, in a suit is now like, oh, FNAF reference. It's like, no, it's not, but I know they're similar. It could be me. Okay, I want to do that crash thing. Hopefully it works. <clears throat> Ooh. I have at least six names written here, and how many characters are out there on the island? Um, Not counting wolves, there was Bunny, JD, me, um, Olive, Walter, the Giovanni, I th and, and the, the Chief Wolf. Those are like the only named characters we have. There's like seven. Oh, and the, yeah. Horns. Stop reversing my controls. <laughs> okay. Bum, 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 bum. Dude, I hate... Walter? I hate that face. What is that? Oh. Oh, it keeps it keeps reversing my controls, and I hate it. Could be G-Man. You never know. Oh, for once, I want Matt Pat to make a theory on something. I guarantee you, he'll he'll get his his little his fingers all over this game, or whatever you want to call that. <laughs> He's too busy talking about how uh, Pomni is Jesus, which I kind of agree with. I I don't know. They wouldn't really like use all that religious Im imagery in a digital circus if it wasn't going to be something. But I don't know. What? There was the, the film theory a couple days ago. He was like, Pomni is a Christ figure. Which... Makes sense, because they had, I don't know, they had all, like, the Last Supper imagery and, and stuff, and it was kind of, I thought it was dumb as hell. He was like, Jesus wore red and blue. Oh, I didn't realize it was nighttime. We heard you just, what? Did you not watch the map? Oh, oh. Hello? Who are, what are, oh. Oh, you're the guy in the suit. Or are they, they're like wicker men. Hello. Mullins. Mark Mullins. She hadn't been acting right. I took her to the hospital. I walked out on my own. They said that she's going to be there for a while. What happened? Huh? Who's Mark Mullins? <laughs> I feel really gross looking at my own reflection. Where am I? Do I, look, do I really look like this? I never felt so discontent. Yeah, did we get Mark Mullins as like a name before? I can't remember. Oh! No! Oscar Lee, what the hell? Why are you here? Hello? You're in the wrong minigame. And your eyes are missing. 
Oh no. I just realized the parts thing is also here. For some reason. Although that's been here the whole time. Oh, is it their dead souls follow you around or something? I'm just gonna like have them all die. Oh their their souls are haunting me. They're like the kill the the kids from FNAF. Those hooks are sharp, huh? I know you got this though. Come on, you can do it. Are you paying attention? Hello? You're just skipping past all these, aren't you? You're as inconsiderate as I remember. <laughs> I didn't know he's yelling at me about skipping dialogue. Whoops. No! Oh my god, I was just moving for like two seconds. Oh. I do need to still crash the game, but I... I didn't want to do all of that. I, I should have done it, I think. That might answer... Oh, hello. God, I hate how good the animation is. It's uncomfortable. Scary. What was that? Was that Bucky killing Walter? Wait, oh. Wait, why is this open now? Oh. Uh. <laughs> uh oh. Where am I? What is. There's a big statue over there. What is going on now? What the hell? We're in the main menu, but it's. The camera's locked. Uh oh, I've I've gone. Where am I? Hate mark, not R X B C. Is that another thing to decode, or does R X B C mean hate? Would that help at all? Like, is that how you're supposed to figure that out? As in. Wait. If if B equals T no, that doesn't work. I don't think that's is that a cipher? Or like do I have to decode that again? <laughs> I got to take a picture. We got to get a screenshot. Swoop. I need to make like a giant Photoshop thing of like every everything I've found in here. Boop. Boop. All right, there's that. Then let me save this here. Sorry, I got to save some stuff. Okay. I got Silent Hill. <laughs> It really, it does feel like it. We just stumbled into the alternate reality. We're in the Silent Hill. What is this? It's scary. <laughs> what is that? Is that the movie? Oh, it's a recording. The label says sheet music. Hello, this is Wolf. I was using one of the silver tech computers around the place, and would you look at what I found? Online, there were just sheet music everywhere. So I could just take one, print it off, and play it on my piano. <laughs> it's lovely. I found this one song I want to try. It's called Hot Up. This is Wolf. What song? What was the name? I don't know. 
I don't know what he said. He found sheet music? Why is the door open already? What door? I think it was just nighttime and I, I went into it. I don't know what... This is straight up like a room from Silent Hill 2. <laughs> Oh! Any lockers work? Uh... <laughs> I don't know what's going on. Wait, I can jump! I'm getting out of here. Oh. Uh. <laughs> what is this? Where are we? What are we doing? This is... Oh, this reminds me... Kind of like Beginner's guide -y. I don't know if anyone knows that game. Where it's like exploring unfinished games from people. And like... It's a really interesting game, but it's... It's not this style of game, but it's it has a similar vibe of like just walking around in some something that like someone put together but they never finished. Wee. Oh, another door. It's locked though. Oh man. Smash that like button. What's going on guys? What's I forgot Jack Septicai's intro. What is this intro? Top of the morning! <laughs> Top of the morning! <laughs> Top of the morning to you! Um... Do I just go back now? Maybe that other door's open. Oh my god, this level... <laughs> what is this? It, like... RxBC... Not hate mark... Why does it say not? It feels like it's a code or something. It's tell I don't know. I've got it. I've got it in my picture folder that I made. Ooh. Dude, where the hell? Where the hell are we? <laughs> Mark Mullins. I forgot that name. Oh, a button. The label says code is RxBC. Yeah. Code to what? Code to Mark's house? Hmm. Freddy Fazbear. Oink, 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 oink. What do I do with him? That's me, right? Or it's like the, the more realistic version of Bucky? Was that a classroom? I don't think it was. It was like a bunch of houses. Oh, you mean the, the one above that? Maybe. Congrats. It's a photo of the wolf, Chief. Congratulations on the migration. I know times have been hard lately. Bro broadside's influence is very heavy up there. Enjoy a life of luxury, Chief Wolf. Enjoy a life of luxury. Yo, shipwreck! They put it in the game! Remember how Olive spelled out Olivia using the first letter of words? Oh, you're yeah. supposed to know about, like, the phonetic alphabet? What is it? RxBC? What does that say in, like, what is it? Uh, is it military alphabet? What is it called? NATO phonetic alphabet. Uh, Romeo X-Ray Bravo Charlie. Right? What does that mean? Oh. Romeo X-Ray Bravo Charlie. <laughs> uh, no 
No, go back in. Don't go... Where are we now? Uh, hold up, hold up, hold up. What the hell is go... I don't get this right now, but it, this feels like... Mist, kinda. Oh, the lights. This just feels like exploring... It's this room! From the, the main menu! But I'm, I'm so confused, man. What does that show? I can't tell what's on that red picture. Hmm. <clears throat> oh, hi. Is that me? It's a recording of me. Oh, no, it's not. Yeah, the boat. Can you jump off the boat? Is there some secret? Oh! <laughs> this game is so interesting. I I can't wait to just know... Ow. I can't wait to, like, know everything about it. Because at the moment, I'm just overwhelmed and very confused. But... Um... It's really cool. I love stuff like this. I meant to go... Ah, I should have gone to, to the hallway there. Let me... I'm going to go back down that hallway. Hold up. <laughs> I'm overwhelmed. But I need to go... There was like the end of this hallway back here. I wanted to explore that. Oh! It's uh, our, our buddy's room. This guy. Or no, he hunted one. Oh, uh-oh. It looks like Walter. Strange. Come meet Bucky's right-hand man, Walter Walrus. Frontier Street, 6 to 8 p.m. Tuesday, Friday. Only at Studio Grounds. Copyright Broadside, 1996. Hmm? What about this? It's a note about obelisks. Very important. Today, me and Liz were listening to music. Suddenly, the song changed and a loud rumbling was heard three large obelisks began to rise from the water golden statues of the three pure souls rested on top that's that thing we saw over there right am i one of the three pure souls wake up that's that statue we saw like right there right is that the one of the three pure souls no, I was, I was asking the same thing. Like, is this the guy wearing the mask and walking around? It doesn't look like a, a wolf. But maybe it could be. I don't know. Looks more like a goat. That's not how mirrors work. Um, <clears throat> yeah, it is a bit of a weird... Whoa. It is really weird. Oh, I just realized my reflection isn't in there. I'm a vampire. Why? Wait, no, my reflection is... Wait, 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 hold up, hold up. Am I me? I am me. <laughs> I thought I was a different character in the mirror. Okay, so now we can go clip through the wall. Oh, wait, there's a, a purple one. There's a purple screen, too. It's got, oh, it's got me, but scary me on it. The mirror shows a different room. Is it? Was it the same room? I, I honestly, like, didn't notice. I thought it was just reflecting the perspective of the camera, which I thought was... I guess that's how it works in real life. <laughs> it had barrels? There were barrels in the corner. So it's this, like, jittery wall, right? That's where I can jump through? Oh. Oh. I'm in. Where I'm in, I don't know. 
<laughs> There's a secret meeting going down down that yeah down there. And he's looking at me too. <laughs> he knows. Oh. RXBC. How does that translate to one through nine? Oh, wait, wait, wait. What was the number in the beginning? Was it 4724 or something? Yeah, was it the achievement code? 4742. Ah. Did you figure out the lore? I got no idea what's going on. No more saving. Type 6969. Very cool. It explicitly told me the code is RXBC, which <clears throat> to me, can I do like modular math on that or whatever? Uh, modular calculator. <laughs> I don't think that would work. I feel like that's a leap. You missed it? Is this not where to put RxBC? Is it something with... Yeah, I was thinking, like, is it something with... There's, there's like the hate mark thing here. Let me, I can show you, where is it? It didn't show up. My crappy Photoshop. <clears throat> this, right? It said RxBC. Oh, this is a picture. It's not, wait, what? Is this a door? What is this? Hate mark not what are you is this a drawing of like that door we were just at i don't know <clears throat> yeah well, is, is it tally marks as well because it's like um it's like a oh, i can't even draw why won't it let me draw no There's like tally marks right here, like, psh. but hmm, that's a table thing for comparing things, huh? Hate mark. I don't know if this is any anything, but um, I mean it's probably something. <clears throat> I wanna. What is? Is there anything I missed in this area? Now I'm hooked in. Ooh. I love that the wall physically moves up when the camera turns around. That's really funny. Swoop. It's me, Bucky. Bucky boy. Um. Oh. <clears throat> Anywhere that I didn't check? Hello, why, what the hell? What's going on here? I don't know where this is. Under the water, there's something in, in an area. Why is it a different camera angle? Is it where I died? I think it glitched. It kind of does look like glitched out slightly. I think it was where I died. <laughs> I love how this game could have legitimate bugs in it, but you couldn't tell. 
it, like there's no way to tell if it's intentional by the the real life developer, not like the fake in game developer, or was it just like an accident? No. Oh. No. <clears throat> Was I able to talk to those NPCs? I couldn't get to them. But there was this, right? I need... Bravo. Charlie. Standby. What is, is standby in the phonetic alphabet? What the heck was that? Oh, I bet I can translate that. I don't know what standby means in, in the phonetic alphabet. Does uh is that like is it a Morse code type thing? Standby. I've never seen like standby used before. Is it a way to tell, like, a, a split? Because it feels like a, a Morse code type thing where you need a way to tell you're done talking. Here, I'll <laughs> hate that sound effect. I'll do it one more. I'll try and play it again and try and get what it says written down. Did that work? You're really not going to let me play that again? The label says code is RXBC. We know that. Romeo. Bravo. Bravo. Stand by. Lima. Bravo. Bravo. I don't know what it said before that last Romeo. It says like, Bo. It might be saying golf. Like that's G, right? Uh, Alpha, Bravo, Charlie, Delta, Echo, Foxtrot, Golf is what I'm assuming it said? Because Golf is G? Standby probably means full stop. I'm assuming it's like a space between words. I've got R, L, R, X, R, B, C, 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 R, R. Standby, L, X, B, C, G, R. But, uh, what did that mean? I don't know. Is that like, is it a Vision A cipher? And the code is RXBC? That'd be kind of interesting. I'm like ready to go outside the game. <laughs> I feel like I should stop doing this. Yeah, that didn't work. <laughs> I got Aqua <laughs> Vibalaku. So. I have, what the hell? I don't know what to do with, with this. But I have that at the moment. It was like R L R X R B C C C R R. And I have no idea what to like translate that into. And the fact it says, like, the label says code is RXBC, which, I don't know, that doesn't really, like, oh, shit. Um, can I bring that back, please? If the code is RXBC and the label says code, or, what, what, that doesn't, I don't get it. <laughs> Yeah, any hints? Or do I have to look it up? Or is it just something I don't know yet? Romeo. 
X-ray. Stand by. Is it buttons? Is there a C button? I think you're right. Be like R L R. Wait, R L R. I forget what X is, cause I'm on a this. Uh. No, there's no C. What is a C button? Like a D pad? Yeah, is it buttons? I don't get it. Kitty cat, do you know? Yeah, there's the C, like... Not buttons, okay. Because C, it specifically referred to the buttons at the beginning. Oh, no. <laughs> it referred to the buttons as, like, B and A. Your mother. Your mother. Thank you for the, the one month of membership. <laughs> Your mother. Yeah, the C button's that yellow camera button, but it didn't... I don't know. It didn't refer to it as that. Hmm. RXBC. I don't... Is there a way to give a hint without just, like, outright saying it? Is it something I've seen? Some of the letters are wrong. How does that work? <laughs> if they're wrong, then, uh, have I not found the way to like translate that? Cause if not like, Oh my god, I gotta keep adding window captures. <laughs> Boom. If I don't know what it, what it means. Bucky doesn't take any L's. <laughs> Should all be either RX, B, or C. Delete any other letter that is not RX, B, C. That makes... Is that what the not means? That's kind of... I don't know. I expect this is done in almost two seconds. I mean, if you've seen someone like solve it already, probably. But I don't know what I'm looking at. RxBC. So remove the L? And... <laughs> remove the L and the Gs? I don't know. Do I have the answers? Like, do I have all the answers in front of me? Is there some element I'm missing? You are close. We got a little happy guy. I don't know. Some letters you heard wrong? Yeah, that's what I was thinking. It's like a number thing. Oh, maybe... I, I did think it was weird that there were like three C's in a row, but here, let me listen to it. X-ray. Stand by. I don't think I got any wrong, right? It, he said golf. How many R's are there? Six. Well, no, that goes like five or... You did? I know what it's for. What? I'm just like counting at the moment. 5113. I've solved the puzzle. I have solved the riddle. Is it? 
I guess another question, is it too that... It, it goes to that, that code above me, right? I don't see like where else it could, it could go. Oh wait, can I clip into it from here? Oh, gamer. <laughs> Wahoo. Whoops. I'm in. You have the correct way to solve it, but not the right numbers. What does that mean? I have the correct way to solve it, but not the right numbers. My brain is not clicking with this one. It's too, like, grainy of an image to, for me to be able to even see it. Don't listen to Drifties. You're mishearing words? What am I mishearing? Is it not standby? Is, is it another, like... Um... Is it Sierra? It doesn't sound like it. What is it saying? It's saying standby, right? I'm willing to give you the code. I would rather you give me the way to get the code from like this. I have no idea. Like this doesn't make any sense to me. It says skibbity. Oop. You need to hear them right, but you aren't. What am I mishearing? Let me go back to it. Ooh. Let me get back to the game. It's so slow. Where the hell even are we? What are we doing? <laughs> I don't know why this is, this is so neat. There's something like clipping through the floor there. Why are we here anymore? Just to suffer. Wahoo. Was I supposed to remember... Was I supposed to remember the code that, like, Olivia gave me? It was just her name in, like, the phonetic alphabet, but... Uh, there wasn't anything weird about it, I don't think. There's no L or G. It's saying Lima, though. Code is RXBC. Yeah, I don't... <laughs> what I, I guess just like, what is the code then? I don't know. Is it a... How does this translate to numbers? Like, maybe if I know the answer, it'll make sense. <laughs> I just... I'm not seeing it. He audibly says stop, does he? It sounds like golf or stop. I think it is golf because like it wouldn't make sense for. I don't think you do stops in. In that, I don't know though. I've never like, 
<laughs> done anything with the, the NATO alphabet. Mm. Are you putting the numbers in the correct order? I'm, this is how I'm hearing everything. It's randomly generated? I don't know. It could be gen like randomly generated because they can just say the the words. So I'm just trying to figure out how to even like translate this. It might be something I have to like think about more, but also hate mark. What does that mean? I don't get what that means. RXBC. This is the hex ARG. <laughs> That's what I was thinking. You just count the number they appear. But I didn't know the order and I was just I was just going left to right. But I don't know. <laughs> it's not very clear. Hmm. I can give you the solution then? Yeah. It says the code is RXBC. It does be saying that. Is it just number of R's? Uh, I think I get it. Is it just number of R's, number of X's, number of B's, and number of C's? I think. Right? Which would be... Um... Like... Sorry, I can't count. My brain hurt. Six... Whoops. Six two then B's is two R four. Six two two four? I guess. If it doesn't work how you're doing it, then I'll give you the code. Unique geese used. Oh heck yeah. I'm in. Boring. Let's see if that works. Let's try this one. Hello, what are you doing up there? I'm in. I got it. Stand by. Who's this Romeo guy? I don't know, but I'm in. That took too long, but I got it now. Don't have to worry about RXBC ever again. We beat the game. I hit a button. Please do something. Oh no. He's, pl he's playing himself. He's taking over. The three golden statues. The pillars. They talked about this. <laughs> There's JD. These are the, the good souls, right? The chief wolf, the bunny, and JD. What does that mean? <coughs> oh! There's a hole over there. What do I do? What do we do? Hi! What are you doing looking at me? Hold up, can I come say hello to you? <laughs> Dude, this is like... I mean, that's what the, the point of this game was, right? It was meant to be... Kind of like pet... Oh. It feels kind of like a, a Pets Cop situation where it's meant to be this game that, like, no one, like, you would have seen a Let's Play of it and it would have been all spooky, but this this is meant to be, like, a playable version of, of kind of, like, a Pets Cop type game. It's so cool. I love, I don't there's something so fun about just exploring this empty-ass area. <laughs> I love it. It's so quiet and like eerie. Ooh, where does this go? I can't get over that sound effect. It's so good. Whee. Duh. Oh, the floor door. Yes. I'm in. Oh no, where are we? What is this game? Does it go forever? 
Haven't watched Pets Cop me neither. You're not alone. Uh oh, we're in Ban Ban. This was the main menu. This was like 1997 mode. Oh my, I'm in the damn RAM. Cogware games. I'm in the game. EA Sports. Hello. Oh, you looking at me. You're looking at me. Oh, I don't like that. <laughs> it's button. Learn. What does that say? What was that? What appeared on that for like a frame? Someone? Do me a favor. What was that? What was on the frame? I didn't see it. It was a face? I missed it. Hyper realistic blood it was scary. It was a screaming face looking up. Hold up. Can I go back in and get it again? Nope, it's gone. Someone's screaming in pain. Uh oh. All the doors open now. Ooh. Walter. Are you okay? Oh. I hit the door. How do you feel about Obama the throat goat being removed from YouTube? Obama himself probably saw that and was like, I gotta remove it. Why, why'd they remove it? Stop. Why does that happen? Where are we? This smells atrocious. We should leave. We should save. Yeah. We don't gotta walk back. You can open the menu and hit respawn. And we'll be on our merry way. I'm good, Bucky Beaver. It says the dam. Where are we? What is... Whoa. That's me. I'm in the code. 15 seconds, what? Hit all buttons, hit all buttons. It, it put a code up, right? 49223? What? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. It says the diner. Oh, are these unlocked based on the mini games I've done? The pool. What's the floor in? Four, nine, two, three. Four, nine, two, three. Can you please listen to me? My friends are in danger. And you think now's a good time to explore this dump? Hit the respawn button. Use your damn head, idiot. No, I'm gonna four nine two three. I'm in. <laughs> they unlock if you kill them. Oh, okay, that's worse. Hello. Hey, Bucky. What are you doing here? You got friends to save. Go do that. I'm good. <gasps> oh, Cogware Games not secure. Uh oh. This is a bad website. I can't be on this website. My mom says I'm not allowed to go to non-secure websites. But my mom's not here. So I... I'm hacking in. It opened up CogwareGames.com. Uh, Cogware Games was originally an idea that three friends out of Silicon Valley had one night, founded by Connor Thomas, Elizabeth Baker, and Harry Waters. We are a collective of fans of the new and thriving world of gaming, and we put innovation at the forefront. With our first ever demo of the game, Blundercover, 
being a hit with crowds over at local conventions in 1995 and a thriving partnership with the Broadside Animation Company, leading to the creation of the magnificent Shipwrecked. We won't hold back on getting our hands dirty with game development. After all, that's where the name comes from. Every cog in a machine has to be working together to create a meaningful result. We here at Cogware are in it for the players and for moving forward. We've dabbled very heavily into three-dimensional graphics, working with top-of-the-industry professionals to create worlds with depth, color, and life. We make games that are bright and friendly, uh, but you're not getting a squeaky clean experience if you play a game from Cogware. Instances of adult humor and some edge to our games are all present. We believe that games should not be designated to a single demographic, but rather shared among many demographics. We don't make kids games, but we also don't make adult games either. Think of us as a fine line in the middle. Let's keep innovation at the forefront. We can make amazing things. Do you think Blunder Cover exists? If I go to Steam and go to like, can I look up Blunder Cover? Is that real? Thank God it's not real. Uh, Blunder Cover. We're good. I was really worried that this was gonna show a bad image. Contact at Cogwork. Should I, do I gotta email them? Hold up, I gotta do that in like a private browser because it'll dox me. <laughs> Actually, I can do it in like... That's not on screen, right? Hopefully not. I'll email them for my, my YouTube email. This is not that email. Why is that? What do I email them? Do they have a a thing I should ask them? Should I just say hello? The game engine used to create our game. <laughs> we used Unreal Engine. It's the same program used to create the shooter game by the same name, Unreal. It was licensed to us by Epic Games, but it's soon to release to the public. What a cool, oh my God, is this what Unreal Engine looked like in like the early 90s? <laughs> it looks like RuneScape. <laughs> I don't think it was around then, was it? No, it was, I'm stupid, it was. Definitely around. They just, they literally just said, whoop. Yeah, I need to email that, that email. It's very important. Um, Bucky and his friends need your help. After a sudden crash, Bucky ends up on a mysterious island. This is the description of the game. I put you into the shoes of Bucky's imaginary friend as you must help guide him back to his homeland and maybe meet some friends along the way. With a fun puzzle-based gameplay structure, many endings, and dynamic gameplay, you'll never wind up with the same playthrough twice. This game would not be possible without the wonderful partnership between us at Cogware and Broadside Animation, who helped fund the development of this game, as well as providing reference photos and even making a full commercial. Bucky sends his regards. Where's the background of this website from? I don't know. Can I inspect Element? They let me do that? View page source. I'm going in. Um, what do they usually hide stuff in? Uh, I forget what it is. Cogware slash trees.jpg. There we go. I can sneak in and get it. Trees.jpg. Not found. It's, it said it was found, though. It said it was right there. It said cogware slash trees slash jpeg. Maybe I do... Cogware. I'm for oh, this is real. Uh trees.jpg. Ah, oh, I can't get in. <laughs> I probably shouldn't be looking at this yet. I don't know. I think the it seemed like was this broadside.html? What is this? Hey. Hi. <laughs> This was the trailer, right? Fuck, oh, jump scare. He won't load. No, I want to watch this. This was the beginning of the game, right? Step into the 3D realm with Bucky and his friends. I can't watch the trailer, it won't load. Here, I'm gonna email. Should I email them?
There was music! What should I- what should I say in the email? Compose. Um, contact at Cogware Games. Contact at CogwareGames.com What should I ask in the email? Just say hello? Your game sucks ass? No, that's mean. They, they made it a good game. Hello. Um. Hi there. Uh, I've been trying out... I've been trying out... What's this game called? Shipwreck 64. Pretty fun game. I'll put that in parentheses. Uh, LOL. Should I put LOL in my email? Is this a formal? <laughs> Give me secrets. Do you think it's, like, automated? I think it's really good. Thank you again for making... The game. Check the shipwrecked site again. What, this one? Hey, everyone, <laughs> I need your help. Step into the 3D realm of Fuzzy and. Step into the 3D realm of Fuzzy and. Is there anything in the page source? Hotel.html. Oh, yeah, there's an, there's an A right here. Look at that. Good call. Oh, ARG. Hey, let me, I, while I'm doing this, uh, I've been trying out Shipwrecked, and I think it's a really great game. Thank you again for making game. <laughs> it's a really great game. Thank you again for making game. Hi there. Okay, I'm going to send that email. We'll see what happens. <laughs> Will I get a response, you think? Or do you think it's automated? Give me this again. Run it back, run it back. So this is the the creature. The blue guy, right? I hate that zoom noise. Ooh. There's more at the bottom. I don't think I've ever met a man as pathetic as you. What did I do? Oh, there's... There's, uh... I don't know what that is. What is this? What are you? If you gonna give me the page source, Starling Nathan. <laughs> Who is Starling Nathan? Do we know this person? I haven't gotten any response from that email. Hotel.mp4. I don't think I've ever met a man as pathetic as you. Uh. Oh, that's what that thing is. There's like tiny. Those are just tiny pictures down there. These like. <laughs> his head is apart from his body. Is it? I can't tell. It's so. It's so crusty. Is there anything else on this page? I don't think there is. Doesn't look like it. Take me back. I don't think I've ever met a man as pathetic as you. Is there anything else on this page? I didn't really like look. Commercial.mp4. There's that hotel. I don't think there's anything else. Did you know? This is kind of next level authentic. If they respond to my email, that's going to like blow my mind. Or was there a a keyword I needed to say? I'm wondering if it's like a bot. That's my main question is like, is it a bot email that will respond with something that I need? I don't know. Cogware logo, Unreal screenshot. We are Cogware. 
keep innovation at the forefront. Is there anything I missed here? Shipwreck.jpg. There's probably more to find on this website. I need to keep it in the background. What was I doing in this game? I, like, I got totally sidetracked. What the hell was I doing? Um. Oh, that's just a picture of the website and it takes you to it. Okay. Cogware Games. It's a note from Cogware. Whoa there. This room is designated to staff only. Feel free to hit respawn. Connor, Cogware Games. No, I'm good. It's a note from Cogware. If you really want to go down there, well then, feel free. Just be warned. What? If you really want to go down there, feel free. Just be warned. Connor, Cogware Games. What's down there? What did I do? I hit the door on accident. What does that say? Hangman. It says Brandon. I win. I win the hangman. Um, stop. Stop now. There was a... I know, I saw a creature, and then I... Where did the creature go? I accidentally hit the door. It looked like a bracken. Did I win? Uh-oh. None of this is making any sense. I want to go back to the island. I want to go back home. Is that not why you're playing? Look. We can do this, but... Whatever happens, that's on you. Am I clear? Good. I hate that Bucky. What Bucky? Oh good, some light. Wait. We'll need it. The label says PKJ UJB. We don't know how to decode this yet. And it's probably the same code that is used to decode layer. Or do I know how to decode that? It hit her before she even knew it was coming. It started with loud screaming, but reduced over time to mere croaks. Any will to swim away slowly drained away as she sunk down further it's into the, the water, polluting its natural <laughs> color. The rodent stood a few feet away, watching the effects of his actions. And the rodent began to walk away oh, when she stopped struggling. Is this the? <laughs> I'm so bad at audio logs. I don't even pay attention. Like, is that the murderer talking? Is that? I mean, it sounded pretty bad guy. -y. It hit her. It, I gotta listen again. Even was coming. It started with loud screaming. Mm-hmm. Reduced over time to mere croaks. Mere croak because she died. Any will to swim away slowly drained away as she sunk down further into the water. This is polluting its natural color. Bucky describing the stood a few feet away. Watching the effects of his actions. This is that scene we saw, Don't right? Don't begin to walk away. Mm-hmm. When she stopped struggling. Yeah, it's the scene we saw with uh, Olive, where Bucky like threw her into the 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 water there. Well, now what? Oh wait, this is that exact spot, right? Maybe. This is where it happened. This is where I watched Olive die, Parappa. This is where... Oops, oops. Um... No, it's not the same spot, but... Might be the ultimate custom night voice line. Somebody's speaking through that guy because of the echo. 
I don't know. I didn't hear an echo. Where was that creature I saw for like a frame? Oh. They're lying. I'm a barrel? Oh. It's Outlast. It's a stealth section. Look me in the eye and tell me. Tell me what? They're lying. Does it want me to go to bed? Oh, follow. <laughs> Prop hunt. <laughs> I think something's gonna chase me and it was that creature we saw for like half a second that I accidentally panicked. The sheep music, no. A helping hurt hand? I don't know. Oh, oh, I keep forgetting. <laughs> I keep forgetting this video. I, I realize these TVs will do this every time. They're gonna, not that. Um, they're gonna pull up a website every time. This time we got a helping nub by Stumbler and Wolf. Oh no, this is a lot. Uh, about the authors. Stumbler O'Hare is a rabbit and an artist. Growing up, he has been a massive fan of arts of many different forms. In the process, he began to experiment with art on his very own. He took up painting as his favorite art form. Um, he had painted lots of artwork, some of which would even be hung up in the Nulla Terra Theater. One day, Stumbler was hit with a life-changing event, which had him left without arms. Oh no. A rabid wolf had attacked him, and while he did get away, he had to live his life without hands at all. However, he still is, is an amazing artist at heart. He is. He'll be responsible for the drawings in this guide. Then there's Chief Wolf. This guy probably ate his arms off. Um, Chief Wolf helps the fellow wolves on Nella Terra, much like himself. He lives in the outskirts and typically is found guarding the island, keeping it away from harm. He's responsible for the capture of Bucky, Walter, Olive, and Giovanni. He wants nothing more than to help his fellow citizens. That feels like an oxymoron. Why did he capture them? Wolf will be responsible for all the writing and research portrayed in this document. Okay. Where am I? Layer 3 is where you are right now. As you may know, the island is split into layers. What? Layer 1 is the island, outskirts and any attached missions. Layer 2 consists of a pool, a diner, and a waterway. That was with the statues. And now you're in Layer 3, the land of darkness. That's okay though. If you come properly prepared, you should be equipped to either venture either even further or keep yourself safe. To open the gate, locate and charge the computers to three out of three once it's open. Find the gate control and turn it on. What? What do we... Okay. Was I supposed to know? Yeah. I get that. So that was transporting me to layer two. Was I supposed to be able to translate that at some point? Why do I have four YouTube tabs? Because this game has... Well, here's Shipwreck64. This is an unlisted video on the Cogware website. Here's the Cogware channel. Jail1. Am I supposed to watch these? I'll watch these on my own time. I'm really interested. I, this might require a second stream. I thought this was going to be not as much. Candle. Visual of your candle. That's me. That's my candle. Candle is your most important tool in layer three. You are completely in the dark, but that's okay because your candle will light the way. Once you pick it up, you'll have it for the rest of your time here. It will light the surrounding areas, keeping you aware of where you're going. Just know, however, when you leave these areas, you will no longer have the candle. You won't lose it. It'll come back when you visit next, but you don't need it. If you don't need it, you won't have it. Okay. Computer. Computers are a very prevalent thing to come across in Layer 3. Silvertech has graciously, graciously provided us with these computers, which we have stocked all around the place, as a good way to share information with newcomers, like yourself. If you're reading this, either a friend has shared you a link, or you found it yourself through a Silvertech Prime computer. Why is that all caps? Through. Press the big red button on the front when you find it, and you'll be able to learn brand new things about Layer 3. Golden computers, however, need to be activated with the timer. Once they are on, you'll need to find each of them and turn them all on before the timer hits zero. I'll try to leave a map as to where to locate this computer's 
these computers. This is about to get really interesting. <laughs> How big is this? I know, right? I don't know, but I'm in love with it. The Dwellers. Olive and Giovanni. Oh, Giovanni's freaked up. Dwellers, known as starlings, are creatures who live in the darkness of Layer 3, donning the faces of Bucky's own friends. They will wander around the dark searching for any unfortunate little beaver who happens to stumble into their path. Awakened when Walter, Giovanni, or Olive are brought down into Layer 3. Does that mean they died? So Giovanni's not here, but Walter and Olive are at the moment. They will stalk around the dark and eventually make their presence known. You cannot rely on your mini to keep you safe. Look for a barrel and interact with it to hide away. While a dweller may follow you around in layer 3, that doesn't mean they won't try to follow you elsewhere. Stay alert, you may not as be you may not be as safe as you think. If a barrel or any other object appears to be off or moving, hit it until it vanishes so they can hide as well. When captured by a dweller, you'll be taken into a small room akin to that of a prison cell. Little do they know, however, your little rabbit friend knows the code. If you're trapped, the keypad to exit will be 7 Four one eight. Remember that. If you wind up there, you will need this to escape. The fact it's capitalizing a bunch of words is also interesting. I'm gonna put this in my my handy dandy notebook over here. <laughs> okay. Beaver scratch. What the hell? Oh, I know this one. <laughs> Just kidding. Beaver scratch is a language. Here it is. Language used by many folks who reside down here in Layer 3. To speak in Beaver Scratch, you'll want to firstly take your sentence, I miss having arms. And now, once you translate it, you get a very simple translation of J-N-J-T-T. -T. See, it is basically a Caesar cipher, but it's like offset or something. I hope you can figure it out from here. I'm not. I'm an artist, not a teacher. Oh, you just... Wait. It is just a Caesar cipher, but... Is it backwards? Or something? Is that why I couldn't get it? It goes from, wait, H-I-J, no, it's just like a, a thing of, of one, right? You just add a letter, right? Yeah, is, is it not? Why was the Caesar cipher not working for it? Like, you take this, you add one letter to it, or is it just subtracting one letter? Ah, there it is. The well, too high for you to stay home. Hello? Who who just talked? <laughs> the email? What about the email? They haven't emailed me back. Oh, this email. If you need a sentence translated, feel free to send me a sentence to StumbleHair. Oh. I can email this at gmail.com. I can send to stumble o Stumbler O'Hare. Oh my god. So I can send him like this. How quick is he? How quick is Stumbler O'Hare? I send him an email. He hasn't responded. <laughs> That's how you get them? Well, this, like, it, H-I-J-K, yeah, it's just adding a letter. Oh, I'm stupid. It's like a reverse Caesar cipher, so that's why it doesn't just, like, come up instantly. You just subtract a letter from, like, any of this. That's really cool. So this would be, I mean, this is probably, like, wait, what is this? I gotta pull up the alphabet. <laughs> alphabet. This is... Um... G... It says, good... Good... Luck, I think. What the hell? Am I, okay, have I, have we entered a, a Berenstein bear situation? What the fuck? Where's you? 
Why, why is there no U in this alphabet picture? This is the first one that comes up on Google. Why is it the Latin alphabet? Is this, did the letter U just disappear? It's down here. I can see it in this alphabet. No W either? Why is that, why is that the first result to come up when you search alphabet? <laughs> I thought I was crazy for a second. It, it pulled up the Latin alphabet, not the like English alphabet. That, that threw me off for a second. Where What was I doing? <laughs> I thought I was crazy. I was like, where is you? Okay, so if I subtract... Oh, dude! I got a I got an email from Stumbler O'Hare. He said, Hi, this means good luck, friend. Can I take a screenshot and like... How easily... He just said, Hi, this means good luck, friend. So I can send him anything now. I have a contact on the inside. This is this is getting big. Lay there's a fourth. How many, how deep does it go? There's gonna be a damn the iceberg of uh, what is this game called? I keep forgetting. Shipwreck sixty four explained. I'll make the damn video. I don't care. This is why I didn't want you to use outside sources. Yeah, I figured that like. I didn't expect it to... I mean, it looked like a Caesar Cypher. That was just throwing, throwing me off. But it's literally the opposite. But it also does some, some different stuff. I don't know why, why that came with a J. I don't know exactly how it works. But it's not one-to-one -one a Caesar Cypher. But it's very close. And you can kind of, like, guess. Anyway. Layer 4. There's a gate at the back half of the plaza. Look for it, and you'll find it eventually. You gotta get it unlocked using these two simple tasks. Ah. Mission number one. Okay, so you want to get the gate open. Here's what you gotta do. Step one. Find the crystals. There's a computer lying around somewhere, and on it is a video that contains your answer. If you visited the pool, you know what steps to do next. I have no idea what we're talking about. This is... I'm literally gonna have to, like, go and sit down and walk through this in my head like I, I i need to end the stream shortly probably i would sit here like all night and play this i honestly want to just scrap the the knuckle i continue to push knuckle sandwich back and come back to this <laughs> okay step one though find the crystals there's a computer lying around somewhere and on it is a video that contains your answer if you visited the pool you know what steps to do next what do you mean by the pool like layer two pool Step two, find my tape player. I did record the code for future use, but I forgot it. Look around. There's a tape player somewhere with the workstation code on it, recorded by yours truly. Maybe look for my little home away from home. Seems like a reasonable place to leave it. Home away from home. Seems like a reasonable place to leave it. What? Play far away from Giovanni. He can hear these. Step three. Start the task. Go to the sky hallway and look for the door with the music note next to it. Press the button to begin. The monitors will instruct you on what to do next. Good luck, Bucky. What about task number two? Okay, so you want to get the gate open. Here's what you got to do. Step one, find the batteries. Look for glowing green batteries. There will be one in the office, one in the rooftops, and one in the cave. What is this game? I know, I don't know what that voice line was. It scared me. Step two, drop them off. Bring the batteries to the computer in the basement. Drop them into the open box. Step three, toodles. You can go now. Be free. This is an overwhelming amount of information, but I I want to keep all these tabs open. Review this. Come back tomorrow with, like, notes out the wazoo. And I do not want to look up a thing about this game. This is awesome. Um, What else? There's one more page on this. What do I draw? This has nothing to do with Layer 3, but as most artists experience at one point or another, I'm dealing with Burnout, the creativity killer. Well, this sucks. If you see this, why not toss me a suggestion on something to draw at stumblerohair at gmail.com. I'll, dra I'll gladly draw it. Is this an AI? <laughs> what, should I, what should I get him to draw? Can I give him... <laughs> I know it came out today. Draw me. How do I? I feel like it's like an AI model. I have to describe it. Here, let's. I'll email Stumbler O'Hare. 
All right, to Stumbler. What's his email? StumblerOhara at gmail.com. Can you draw? Can you draw me a purple, purple spider cat? Doing a thumbs up, question mark? Thank you. Is this going to work? <laughs> no way you could just send him drawings. I mean, it's probably just like an AI like hooked up to chat GPT and it just like generates a, a message or something. I got to sit here and watch my inbox. Is he going to respond and be like, that's too complicated for me, friend. Sorry. A equals B, B equals A, and every two letters are swapped in. Yeah, it's a very simple thing, but it's cool you can just text him and he'll help you out. This is so cool. Then there's more to explore too. Here, I'll I'll let him <laughs> I'll let him cook in the background. But Ooh, where the hell am I? So this is layer three. We've learned this is this is gonna have to be more than one stream. <laughs> We're gonna come back to this and be like, all right, here's I'm gonna have like a whiteboard of stuff. Where do I go? More. This is a Silent Hill 2 room. Hello. Where's your red flannel? I wore it yesterday. I didn't want to wear it two days in a row. I don't know. I just didn't. Silvertech Prime 1995 login. Username? Password? This... This sound effect is like the best part about this game. It's so funny to me. Button. What'd that do? I thought that was a secret because look how it look how it lights differently. Is this where you were? I don't know. I just got here. The website talked about dwellers and they're also known as starlings. One of your tabs is also named Starling. Hmm. I don't know. I like it was an overwhelming amount of information for me to all take in at once. Dude, what is this room? It's I'm gonna have to go and review everything. Ooh, big battery, one out of three. We need to activate the three computers. That was our goal, right? <laughs> Ooh. Do I have a code? I don't remember. I have that one code. There's a button down there too. Gate control. Yeah, Sterling or Starling Nathan was a, a name we got. This wasn't this one, right? Like 7418. Whoops. Did he text me back? He texted me the frick back. Interesting. I could give that a try. Wait, he didn't send it to me. No picture. He, he hasn't sent me the picture. Hopefully he'll have that soon. Stumbler O'Hare texted me the frick back. <laughs> no way. That's <laughs> so funny. I'm making. I'm trying to make a mental note of everything, but this is a lot. Beaver speak. Write that down. I, we don't even need to write it down. I could translate it myself, but I could also say, Stumbler, Stumble O'Hare, uh, MJMFXXPFJHGs PMF. Hit me up, Stumbler O'Hare. <laughs> Do not email Stumble O'Hare at 3 a.m. He will text you the frick back with a picture of spider doing a thumbs up 
I, I secretly hope he like emails me that back in an hour. That'd be so funny. Oh. Text me the frick back. Bucky. Bu bu Bucky. MJMF. Um. Mm, what's before J? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I. That says nine, nine something. Have you texted me back yet? I'm waiting for Stumble O'Hare. <laughs> two? Yeah. Nine, two. Oh, it's the code. Nine, two, something, one. Nine, two, eight, one. I don't need you stumble here. I got you. I got myself to figure this out. <laughs> oh, I'm in. The label says, God damn it. <laughs> stumble. Oh, he got back. Stumble got back to me. He says, this translates cleanly into 9281. Numbers. Fancy. <laughs> Thank you, Stumble. Um... Can I reply? Will he respond? What about B E E J? I wonder if he, like, will he respond if I talk? Maybe I should be careful. I don't know if he'll, like, freak out if I don't say uh, just the thing I want translated. <laughs> I don't even respond to him. I just, like, ask for the next thing. I don't even say thank you. It'd be really funny if one of the team members drew really sketchy drawings of what you emailed. That'd be so good. Shout out to Stumble O'Hare. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm gonna be honest. Uh, I'm gonna sound like uh, like a madman uh -huh. recording. One of these things, you know. I I I, I just kind of need to feel like um, I'm talking to someone, even if I'm not. So, yeah. Um, <sighs> shit. I'm gonna start. Uh, you know, this week uh, hasn't been the greatest. Hello, uh, well, let's say it lightly. Now, this, this week has been. Who's well, talking? Um, everything feels like it's just going off the deep end, and um, I'm just starting to wonder how much I got left. <laughs> Affirmations one. What the hell is going on? I'm sitting in this office. It's it's big, it's cozy, yet it feels so empty. Oh, these these are his affirmations. I see. Not a single soul has entered this room in days, aside from you know myself. But um, I, you know what? It, it doesn't matter. Just uh, just just remember your affirmations. And you'll be fine. Hell yeah. What now? I didn't quite follow what he, what he was doing there. Was he... I, those noises were like overlapping and I couldn't tell. Was that like someone dying? <clears throat> I'm not sure. I know, I wish I... I, I should just have my notebook open so I can easily translate it because it's not really that hard to translate oh Ooh, a button what'd that do <laughs> this is such a weird game like it's blowing my mind like I I'm very glad this was recommended because I, I knew about it but I was like eh, it's not that big oh there's Walter back there, by the way. It was the, when the demo was out. Like this wasn't at all what was in this, right? What did that button do? Look at Walter creeping over there, man. Oh. <clears throat> Why did the devs add this in the first place? Like, yeah, cool, makes a game. ARG, we have meant to simulate a real game. Why is this a part of the game? 
I think it's just cool ARG stuff, and I love it. Uh-oh. What'd I do? Yeah? I'm back. I'm back here. Why? <clears throat> I had tasks, right? I can't remember. What were my tasks? <laughs> Let's pull up my, my Among Us tasks real quick. Um, uh oh, I closed the tab. I need that. What was my task? Mission number one. You want to get the gate open. Look for glowing green batteries. There will be one in the office, one in the rooftops. I'd what? This is like, I don't know what the hell. Save, please? Honestly, at this point, I don't even know if saving does anything. It clearly does, but... Person that made this is 18? That's crazy. <clears throat> what am I doing with my life? <laughs> oh, no. Oh, it just respawns you there if you die. I gotcha. Hmm. Wasn't there another door in here? Nope. Spawn points for relaunching. Okay. Is this the first game this developer's made? It, it can't be, right? It feels very experienced. Yeah, there is that, dude. That's what this would feel like. That um, that Mario mod. It was like B. It was a B three three one three, right? Where it's just like empty half the time. That always looked like a fun time. This really does feel like that. That Mario, like you're just in the. I don't want to say like the back rooms of it, but you're in like. Of the place you're not supposed to see in the game, and it's really neat. And you're just lost exploring this, like, super expansive world. It's so fun. Is this the same vibe as, like, B3313? If it's the same vibe, I'm all about it. I'll, I'll try it eventually. I've been meaning to, like, get around to playing it, but I never really did. Ooh. What if? The skibbity rooms. Skibbity bop bop bop, yes, yes. Uh, see fuck poo. <laughs> this says... Be... Be... Uh, be... What, what comes before you? Or is that V? Bucky don't swear. See fuck! <laughs> I'm... Let's see if we can beat Stumbler Hair. Or stumble O'Hare. Reply. C F U K P H Q B M C P N. It says B B E. What comes up before you? Uh, A B C D E F G H I J K L M N O P Q R S T U T. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K. Um, this might have to be a stumble one. I don't know what it says. Does it say devlog? Oh, is it adding one? Wait, is that how this works? Do you add one, then subtract one, and alternate? I've been doing it wrong the whole time. I don't know the dang alphabet. I have to say it all in my head. Is it alternating? Oh, here we go. Devlog random. Yeah, you add one, then you subtract one from F. And then... I think it alternates. I don't know what the deal with it is, but it does say devlog random. All right. Today is August 12th, 1996. We've been given the go-ahead to get back to work on the project. It's been rocky, but rocky. we're all getting back into it. Harry's been at his workstation all day, playing through, well, 
He's been stuck on all of the levels. The coconut one. Apparently, the there's coconut been an levels. issue with the chests spawning in. They just appear a random, which is already bad. But then they soon vanish when you get too close. Do they? I'm really just not sure. It's very confusing. I'll figure it out soon, though. So. I'm sure of it. And Liz has been busy as always. She's trying to catch up on the game's artwork. We finally got a finalized design for the wolf guy, mostly changing his proportions. So we can share his animations with other characters if we need to. But yeah, she's killing it, as usual. And Hell yeah. on my end, not too much. Oh. I'm just chipping away on a little debug map right now. Calling it just the plaza for now, until we can think of a cooler name for it. But yeah. The debug map. That's where we're at right now. I'm gonna keep recording these. They're very fun for sure. Alright, see ya. See ya. Can I I I'm like gonna sing this game's praises like all year. This has been this background music is so good. It's so chill and like perfectly mysterious. It, it, it's gonna be like YouTuber background music in six months, I guarantee it. Me explaining the creepy sad lore to Skibidi Toilet. Okay, so I need a gate code. We gotta put together a lore document in here. Oh, good. Code is EF69? EFG9? Oh, to joy. Is this Ode to Joy? <laughs> Code is EFG9. Is this a uh, music? Is that a G? Why would a lower case? Oh, because it's... Well, it's probably a music thing, right? I don't know how to read music. Wait. Is that Ode to Joy? Ode to Joy. It's not playing. That is not Ode to Joy. No, it is. Shout out to Beef Oven for making this one. Do I need to look at the sheet music? Oh, shit. <laughs> oh, the joy sheet music. Do I have to look at the, the notes? And I don't know. I, I, maybe I'm thinking too hard on this one. I don't know how to read music, and that's a problem. But is it like... You're going to get copyright? The Beef Oven is not going to copy sh trick me. Beef oven. <laughs> Code is EFG9. Do you have to like no notes with letter? Um, that is not useful. Wait, there's no, is there even an E on a keyboard or a piano? You heard footsteps? I dropped my phone. What what letter of the alphabet is E? Whoops, I meant uh Is that not a nine? That's what I'm thinking. It's like count the notes, but 
from what I can see, Ode a la Joy by Beethoven, there are no E's. I don't know if that's... Hold up. It's not even on the screen, sorry. There you go. Ode a la Joy. I don't know how to read music. Is this, <laughs> is this correct? <laughs> Wait, zero was a number? Was it? I can't imp- well, sorry, you can't see it. I can't input zero. There is no zero. I have so many tabs open right now. It's actually crazy. <laughs> oh, that was really loud. Bum, bum. One, two, three, four, six. I don't know. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> we need to call up Beethoven. He can help us out. I had to Google alphabet for this stream. I'm stupid. <laughs> I'm dead straight up. <laughs> Googled alphabet. Do you think Stumble O'Hare can have hints about this one? Wasn't, wasn't I supposed to be under attack or something? Oh, button. Gate control. Oh, one out of three big batteries. Big battery. Google didn't expect someone to actually have to look up the alphabet. <laughs> so it gave me the Latin one, yeah. Okay, um... Label says code is EFG9. Is that a G? That's a G, right? Website that tells me what piano notes are being played uh, in audio. <laughs> I don't know. Can I just like upload? Is there a software available that can identify the notes being used in a song? Pitch Lab Pro. Can I just. Oh, a web audio experiment detecting piano notes. This is a Medium article. Ah! I need a, I need just like a website. <laughs> I need a website that can tell me what notes are being played. Because I sure don't know. Melody scanner? No, this is like a... Oh. Has someone else solved this one? Because I, I have no idea. That seems to be my next point of progress. I've sent the image that shows the music notes. Oh. Bing, 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 bing. EFG G. That's not a nine, so it's a little G. Is this correct? <laughs> My voice. One, two. I think you're right on that. Which would mean, let's see. Five, six, seven, seven. Let me. Yeah, I think you're. I think you're onto something there. Well, no, no. There's only two little G's in this. It's in the Discord. Sorry, I should probably pull it up on the screen. Um. This is not the right page. There we go. This was the one you pulled up, right? So we want EFG 
and then little g. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Am I reading this right? I don't actually know. Is this all the the same? Seven, nine, five, two. Nope, not that. Sorry. What the fuck are we doing? <laughs> we are trying to find... I don't know. Bum, 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 bum. Wait, where does that start in the song? <laughs> Wait, give it back. Come back. It goes... Nah, 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 nah. I don't know where I am. <laughs> I don't know where I am. Only the first part is used? Is it the first or the second? Dun, dun, dun. If it's the first, then it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, which I think you already told me this. And then F's were, what's F sharp? But I guess it doesn't matter. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Wait, one, two, three, Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Then G is one, two, three, four, five, seven, nine, five. And then there's no little, well, little G's. Where are those? Is it the bottom then? Could be the bottom. What do we got? E, F, G, little g, right? So, one, two, three. Then, one, two, three, four. Then, one, two, three, four, two. Three, four, two, two? I don't know. <laughs> oh. Did I even count that right? I feel like I, I misread. I'm going back in. <laughs> How many notes are there to discover? Use only the top row? There's no little g in that, though. That doesn't work the same. Because we need... The notes, right? Um, let me, let me double check. It is the label says E F G, little G. I don't know music terms. E. Three. The second part isn't in the tape though. Oh, it's not? I don't, I don't know where the like. Dun, 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 dun. Is it this? Go. It's that, right? But where is. I'm about to be in the bathroom. Oh, <laughs> what is this? It's a damn rabbit hole. We've fallen in the rabbit hole. I don't know music. <laughs> I'm a beaver. Or I'm Bucky the beaver. I'm down here. I don't know where the hell I am. I'm in the damn back rooms. Um, And there's a code. It goes... Bum, 
bum, bum, bum, which is Ode to Joy by Beat Oven. And it says the code is EFG little g. And so we need a four digit code from this. And we're assuming it's count all the the notes in Ode to Joy that are that line up with that code, but it's like I don't <laughs> I don't know what like I don't know music. We have an AI rabbit that we can email though. It's pretty cool. Um Ode to Joy. Is it this is the chorus? Would you call that the chorus? <laughs> Ode to Joy, Notes, Piano. I've sent a simplified one, but there's yet to find a low G. Ugh. Wait, this is simplified? Oh. <laughs> Scary. I'm seeing what I can find. It's kind of tough. You think it's the code Stumbler gave us earlier? I mean, I can try it. He gave us... <laughs> he gave us one of these, right? Oh, no, I have it in a... I have, like, eight different files. 7418 was what he gave us. I'll try it. Plug in my MIDI controller. I don't have one. Nope. It's not 7418. Big battery. <laughs> this, this is like so much. How do I, I can't even get back. Oh, never mind. I'm gamer. We're good. Yeah, 741, it was with if we got caught. And so we haven't had to use that yet. Because there hasn't been any, like, creatures down here in the back rooms. Is there a code? Wait, did he say the code here? But if I could break the wall. All right. Today is August 12th, 1996. We've been given the go ahead to get back to work on the project. It's been rocky, but we're all getting back into it. Uh huh. Harry's been at his workstation all day, playing through, well, he's been stuck on all of his levels, the coconut one. Apparently, there's been an issue with the chest spawning in. They just appear a random which is already bad but then they soon vanish when you get too close i'm really just not sure it's very confusing i'll figure it out soon so i'm sure of it liz has been chopping liz away Liz has been busy as always she's trying to catch up on the game's artwork we finally got a finalized design for the wolf guy mostly changing his proportions so we can share his animations with other characters if we need to. But yeah, she's killing it, as usual. And on my end, not too much. I'm just chipping away on a little debug map right now. Calling it just the plaza for now, until we can think the of a name for it. But yeah, that's where we're at right now. I'm going to keep recording these. They're very fun, for sure. All right, see ya. See ya. I don't know what the hell I'm, like, doing right now. Is there a door I haven't been in yet? I gotta, like, I have to make mental notes of all this, and... I may have to... I should probably wrap up soon. Was there, like, another door in this room that I just didn't go into yet, though? This isn't where you should even be? Can you progress another way? What? I've, I've, at this point, it doesn't feel like there's a should and shouldn't be 
like where I'm supposed to be in this game right now. <laughs> I am lost is where I am. Um, uh, why are you locked? No. Unique geese went somewhere else and actually made progress. Okay. I am not the unique geese. Did he go like backwards? No, I couldn't go backwards. Look me in the eye and tell me. I want someone who, like, just watched the fir th first 30 minutes of this stream to pop in and be like, what the fuck happened? <laughs> What happened, man? I don't know. Oh, button. Oh, we got a... Uh, oh, this is just called three. I got a video. It's a TikTok. Oh, it's our boy. G Gary Wilson. This is a different guy. Okay. That's Gary Wilson. This is a three minute video. Oh my god. Boozes of D. Something of death. It's the background from the site with the bunny on the hotel? Was it? Oh yeah, it was that like one... Uh, this one, right? Was it that background? I don't think it's that one. Press full screen? It won't, it won't change anything. <clears throat> Ooses of D. Oh, the Gary background one. I think I looked at. This feels like... A portion this feels like a part of a video and I'll get like like do you think they split a video into five different chunks and this is just the middle chunk and I have to like stitch them all together oh. <gasps> <laughs> found at the bottoms of the oh my god this is the entirety of the lore because it's not a YouTube short it's like too thin but it's three, which tells me, like, this is the middle chunk. It's like a puzzle piece, right? Oh, that'd be really cool. Is this our boy, Gary Wilson, again? Yeah, see, there's, like, clearly more to this video. And I can't read that because it's over there. Oh my god. What is this game? Sorry to skip through it. I think it's it's evident there's like nothing really in here. And I need to... I mean, there's words that you could get uh, like a small piece of the picture, but... Oh! There's a thing. I'm blocking it. You can't see what's coming. Dude, I'll connect these in a, in a heartbeat. Can I download unlisted videos? <laughs> I'll edit it together. Like, that'd be really fun to do live. Ooh! Oh, this is just like the full picture. Oh. Walter Walrus. Walter. What you can't see in Lethal Company. Results will shock you. Shipwreck 64, the haunted N60. What's this guy doing? I'm not doing that bit again. Can I download an unlisted video? Is that legal? What's something's yelling at me? I can download it. <laughs> yeah, I might stitch those together. Um, 
later because that'd be really cool if there is a bunch i think you need to go back to layer one i i i do think i would need to i mean it feels like you could get this answer here right but yeah there's a lot of stuff i could do as well endless stream i honestly would like keep going all night but i just feel like i'm bothering neighbors at this point if i'm like up past midnight and yelling in here boing, boing. gate control because i i think i would need to go review oh there's so much there's like it's so deep Kill the duck before you end. How the hell do I get out of here? I don't think I can, can I? I don't think there's like a way out, is there? Can I die? Respawn? Oh yeah, that, that's what they've been telling me. What was that? Why did it make that noise? Yeah, we'll have to come back here, I guess. I'll respawn. Oh. <laughs> Everything is scrambled. Uh-oh. Menu. Respawn. Unplug it and plug it back in. Oh, I'm back. Wait a second. Can I also get into... Okay, so we went into this room, right? This was layer two... Yeah, layer two, room three. What about room one? I don't want to... Oh, man. <laughs> Let's see. Does this work? It says... Oh, oh, we're doing this cutscene again. Yeah, this is layer two, room one. The mole. Yeah, it's labeling the rooms. And this leads to the area with like the the big water. Oh, this is not the same area. <laughs> God damn it! There's more. Weren't we in here? This is the pool! Oh, it's all... Okay, we're getting bits and pieces. I think I, I go to sleep. I come back. This is where you were? No, I was never, I've never been in this room. I love this song. They got me on the dang TV. Is this where you were meant to be? Ma What the hell is going on in this game? How big is this game? <laughs> oh, the code is ECDC. <laughs> Hot cross buns. Dun, dun. I don't know how to read music. It's hot cross buns, though, if someone wants to look up the notes for that one. <gasps> Hello. What are, you, what are you guys doing down there? It's me, Bucky the Beaver. Kill the damn duck. If I kill... <laughs> Oh, I know there's more. You don't need to backseat me. I we're this is all like we're figuring this out together. I don't really want to be like pointed in any direction because this is just like a magical experience at the moment. I'm really enjoying it. I can swim. Oh, <laughs> the old behind the waterfall trick. They the classic. Where the hell? Is Can I get coconuts? Give me coconuts. 
Yeah, three blind mice is the other one too. No, oh, it is. I I need to play B three three one three because it this feels like that. I've seen like clip. What is going on with that tree? I've seen clips of that and it it feels really similar. And it, it definitely feels like my house a little bit too with the whole unpacking of the layers is really fun. Is this another? I haven't been in here, have I? I don't know. Whee! Boo -boo -doo. Oh, button. Hi, what are you? What's you? What you doing out there, Olive? You're dead, aren't you? That's awkward. <laughs> Bye. Okay. <laughs> oh. This is very awkward. What did that button do? Oh, it opened this. And this is this room, which we went to earlier when we were like here, right? It all loops together. <laughs> it's all coming together. Sheet music. Wait. What was this? Hello, this is Wolf. I was using one of the silver tech computers around the place, and would you look at what I found? Online, they have a bunch of sheet music everywhere. So I could just take one, print it off, and play it on my piano. Yeah. <laughs> Lovely. I think that's. I found this one song I want to try. It's called Hot. <laughs> I think he says Hot Cross Buns, and that's what he's referring to with that. And so that's a hint to go like look up the sheet music for Hot Cross Buns. I don't know where to put that code in. What the heck was up with that voice line that played out of nowhere? I don't know, and it's kind of bothering me still. I can't get over this, like... This goofy-ass slap sound effect is the funniest thing in this game. It'll never not be funny to me. Where do I put in ECDC? Here's what we do. I think we go... I think we do, we, we come back like tomorrow or something and we go, we go very deep because we have, we have codes that we can decode, but I, I do need to go to bed, but I also want to kill characters and get like a bad ending or something, right? Kill the zuck, the zuck, the duck. <clears throat> oh, you can just walk through the door. Midnight. The evil hour. Giovanni the goose. Why is it night down? It, that's why... It was night time when we started this. Remember three hours ago when we, we went into layer two? <laughs> Remember three hours ago when we, we fell into madness? Day three, everybody. Welcome to day three. I I don't know how I'm gonna timestamp this VOD. I don't think I will. <laughs> this is a VOD that needs to be cut down. But I would also this feels like a game that whoever the person that makes the iceberg video on it is gonna be having a good time. And I, I kinda wanna be that guy. It'd be very fun to like break down this game. Because, man, it's very cool. Wow. There's so much just, like, weird stuff to it. I completely forgot what this map looked like. What the heck is this? You came in at the worst time. We, we've we returned to normalcy. We were, like, stuck in the back rooms for two hours <laughs> or something. It was, it's been a lot. I, it's hard to, what the hell is this? The Riddler. Uh, the bunny is holding. I'll call. I don't like that. Hi. Oh. 
What took you so damn long? I got stuck, man. I can't, I can't explain. <laughs> Wolves have been on my tail all day. All right, let's go fail the minigame. Oh, are you evil? <laughs> Be gone. I'm trying to lose. Leave me alone. Stop, stop, stop doing that. Stop doing that. She does nothing. That's good. I hope not. Oh. <laughs> no. Shit. Oh, no. What did you do? I'm just... You stupid rat. Get back in there and do it right. Okay. All right, flea bag, do your thing. Remember, watch for smoke first. If you see smoke, turn the oven off. Now get out of my sight. I do nothing. No, he's a goose. Yeah, he's Giovanni Goose. Yo, I can clip out of here. My oven already set off? What? You can clip out from the- you can clip out on the top. The, it's glitching. Oh, no. Hold up, I'm glitching out of the map. Get me back in. Giovanni? Talk to me? Hello? Hi. Um, he won't talk to me anymore. Okay, we're doing this. <laughs> Oh my god! Whoa! What the fuck? Giovanni... What the hell, man? That came out of nowhere! It took you so damn long. Look, wolves have been on my tail all day. That was the most violent thing this game has like ever shown. What the fuck? That was crazy. Part of my debt is to cook for these mutts. But I can't turn the dials with these wings. They're useless. Okay, get in there, rodent. I see why they took this one off of, uh... Off the shelves. No, 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 I want to clip out of the map. I can do it. I can go out of... Oh. Again? No. I don't think we get to see that again. Did he just like leave the body on the oven? Oh my god. That's awful. Damn. I, I I have to like I gotta <laughs> There's so much to process. Well he's dead now. Wait, I can go in there. Is this layer two? God damn it, man. What is this? This <laughs> No I literally have to go through and write down I gotta watch the VOD back tomorrow. I gotta write down like 20 different things I have to revisit. There's so much left to do. Coconut. Yeah, I can't clip out of that area because I have to restart. Stop. How deep does it go? <laughs> Boing. 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 Hello. That is his little hand. Why is his little hand in here? Is this who we're cooking for? This is a major hee hee ha ha moment. Oh, I'm dead. We're fine. So why is Stumbler's hand down here? What is this music? Yeah. 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 
I can't. I this. Is, I think this is like inspired by the that Mario mod. Just I was about to say like I love that this game is just like a platformer. Like it still has good platforming controls the whole way through, but there's just <laughs> shit like this. Like what is that? Is that a number? It says eight. Foxy boo. Guy. Hello. I don't know who you are. Hi. Where am I? This is an... Oh. This place is so amazing. After a while, you begin to forget all of this. Most will never see it. I commend you, though. This definitely feels like a game that, like, most people will never see it. A lot of it. Hi, Bucky. Here to observe the arts, I see. I respect that. Take a look around. I'll try. Three. There's numbers. These are codes. We saw an eight. We saw a three. Oh. The codes. The numbers. What do they mean? Nine. I don't like this art. It's all like... <laughs> it's abstract and scary. What is this? Is this an eight? Or a zero? So what I have so far is that you might be like a cook or something, then you know clipped into weird places. No. It's... <coughs> we were like a... We were shipwrecked. And we were just saving our friends, but we were helping our friends at the same time as it's, it's a lot. I'll come back to get that code in just a second. I gotta I'm just mapping out my surroundings right now and I this is the hub between worlds. I get it now. This is like the layer two hub area. You can go to that one, you can go to that one. Ooh. That coconut art was from the concept art secret? Which one? This one? Yeah, you're right. It was. It's the tree. So we got nine, eight, nine. Is that a three? It looks like a three. That's a three. Wait. Then what is that? Eight? Where's layer one? Yeah, layer one was where the the beginning. Like, that's... Layer one is just the game. And then... Layer two is whenever those doors open. I'm guessing those doors open whenever you, like, kill somebody, right? Eight... There's two codes. What? Oh, no. Okay, I... I I hate to end it here. This is, like, one of the coolest games I've ever played. I've, <laughs> I'm in love with this. I hate to end it here, but I feel like I need to go and go to bed. I really want to come back tomorrow and just, like, do the rest of it because I have all these these threads leading to different places, right? I want to write them all down and make sure we, like, I, I want to get all my eggs in a basket together, whatever the, the phrase is. I want to explore all the loose ends that we have and, and make, like, a big Google Doc of stuff that we have to do. <laughs> I'm addicted to another ARG. Yeah. Because, like, it's a thing where the longer I wait to play it, someone will eventually, like, It'll, it'll get, like, spoiled, or, or... The magic of it is kind of lost when, like, you play this in six months and someone's just like, Oh, uh, the code is actually just, like, three, five, seven, eight here. Like, they're just gonna, like, give the answers to you, and you're not gonna be able to solve these puzzles. We're not gonna be able to, like, sit here and just get stuck on things. That's really fun. I, I love that aspect, so... Um... Yeah, I wanna... 
Mm, I'll try to be back tomorrow with it. I, I would love to, to come back to it tomorrow. If not, it'll be it'll be like Thursday or something. I also want to make it. It'd be really fun to make a video on this. I don't know how. I don't know how you would even start. I guess you would do like the layers of shipwrecked 64 unpacking the ARG or some shit. <laughs> Fuck knuckle sandwich. No, knuckle sandwich rules though. It's, it's, it sucks that I keep pushing it back, but this game is very cool. Hmm. The shipwreck sixty four ARG video, dude. I'll cover it. This seems worth like covering. Very cool. I don't know where the story's leading, but it. The thing with with like ARG type games, the thing that interests me is this. I. <coughs> The story is neat, and the cutscenes are, like, jarring, and, and they, clearly there's, like, something going on. But I'm really just interested in exploring and seeing how deep things go. And it'd be fun to do a video of, like, do the do the myhouse.wad video the guy made. Like, exploring your runs through it. Like, I played through, I got the best ending on my first time. Second time through, I tried it again on the 1997 mode. And... Like, doing something like that, I think, would do really well. And especially for a game like this. Be very cool. Might try and, like... Depends on how the game is. If it's, like, 20 hours long, that'd be kind of rough. This is really neat, though. Um, But yeah, I'm going to wrap this up. We have a lot of questions. And I'm going to try and get those answered tomorrow. Try not to spoil things for yourself. Good luck. <laughs> But I'll be back trying this again tomorrow because we are we are in deep and I'm really hooked. <laughs> I'm really interested. So I'll see you hopefully tomorrow. Have a have a good night. And yeah. Catch you later. Bye bye.